hear me? Ah, <sighs> loud and clear. Whoever you are. Good, it worked. My name is Somi. Just call me Song with them. I know who you are. Know your situation, your problem. And I can save your life. All right, Songbird. Got my full attention. Glad to hear that. You must have questions, and I'll answer them in due course shortly. But first, I need you to get to that swollen appendix of Night City called Dogtown. Dogtown. City within Night City. Know of clans who tried to establish footholds on the black market there. Never managed to stake any claims. Hell, some plane never made it back. Fair mistake. One you won't repeat. Answer, please. Fine. No, you're on the line. no clue what I'm stepping into, but no risk, no reward. Thank you. I appreciate this, truly. Dogtown's main gate. Be there as you can. I'll make contact again then. <laughs> this is one elaborate haze. Or a fucking lifeline. What you got in the back? The usual. Implant boxes, Zeta Tech. Rule one, no NCPDs. Back to get a bullet to the brain. Rule two, no force. You're just not welcome. I'm just a chewing driver boxes around. Rule three, my people keep the peace in the district and ensure its security. They are the law. You need to dress it down to piss off. I said no passage. So, can I go? Kind of in a hurry. Petro Kelly, please, I need him. Oh, 
What the? Oh, God, it's like someone shoved my head in the place. Oh. Yeah. You're gonna be okay. Breathe deep. Count to ten. Recite a mantra. Whatever brings calm helps you stabilize. Your nervous system took a big hit. Broke down. Racing heart. Cold sweat. It'll pass. What the fuck are you doing? This a trap? Exact opposite. It's a helping hand. Right. I know about the bomb ticking in your head. If I could disarm it now, I would in a heartbeat. You'll feel better any second now. V something stinks here. I think she's she's fucking with the relic. How in the all true, Johnny. But don't you fret. They're both safe. Nah, fuck both off. Both of us on the biotrip protocol at once can trigger shocks for V, like you just saw now. Gotta cut you off. What? For your safety, for V's safety. Okay. Had to meet him for now. He hears you fine, just can't talk back. Starting to put two and two together. You gotta be a net runner. Damn good one at that. Guilty as charged. Off done the relic's cognitive protocol to dial in. I see and hear what you do. Just now, I am on board Space Force One, sitting right across from Rosalind Myers, President of the New United States of America. The President? Fuck. I. No, you're not joking. Dead serious, yes. The plane's been hacked. Trajectory set for Night City. They'll bring us down to Dogtown soon. Our comms are down, most likely jammed. The relic was my only option. Right now, you're our one contact on the ground. Plane got hacked, right? You're a runner. Can't override? I could. All I need is 24 hours, the right setup, and a bottomless pot of coffee. None of that's available just now. Telling me the in-U.S. President, Rosalind Myers, is there with you? Sitting right across from me. She knows the situation. Waiting for your yes. How do I help? And how much time we got? Too little to avoid landing in Dogtown. Likely enough to minimize losses, save some folks. That's where you come in, V. The President's life, her safety, that's your top priority. She'll survive the landing. Dogtown, not so sure. You'll need to get her out of the plane before anyone else does. Anyone else? Specifically? Meaning you expect in company? Kurt Hansen, Dogtown's Commander-in-Chief. Man's got a thousand and one reasons to want Myers as a hostage. He couldn't have netjacked the plane on his own. Meaning Washington's got a mole problem. That one will need to solve it later. Said you could help me. That the plain truth? Just got a taste of my abilities, I believe. There's more. I can cure you. Once and for all. Why should I trust you? Gave me a seizure a second ago. A side effect. I'm sorry. If it's any consolation, I will make it up to you. Consider this, uh, an advance. Your relic's crowded with clusters of corrupted data. I'm done with that, making room for stuff that'll actually be handy. Such as? Some pre militech combat stuff. It's just lying around, gathering dust. I guess. I'm not being charitable. Need you at your damn best. Now listen. What I gave you is the skeleton soft. But the firmware's fancy. It'll learn. Grow with you. 
It'll improve if you feed it data. Combat analyses. Logs of legendary ops. Shit that make the NCPD piss its boots. Look around Dogtown. Gotta get there first. Main entrance is a no-go. You don't have an entry pass and I don't have time to produce a fake. You'll slip in the back way, quiet as you can. We really don't need anyone spotting you, scanning you. Guess so. After you. I'll be right beside you, as much as I can. Garage. There, past the fence. See it? Smugglers used to use it. Now it's your turn. Try to sneak in. Maybe distract the guards. I don't know. Something. you go. Look for a net access point. Jack in that, and I'll be able to help you. You should be one level lower. Eyes peeled. Look for a way down. Now, look for a maintenance room. Bet anything you'll find a power source inside. access point, but no power. Hmm. See if you can restore it. It's the only way it can be of any use to you. Turn something on. 
Nice, V. Exactly what we need. Okay, we're up. Perfect. Bridging systems now. Hmm. Ancient, no proto ancient protocols. Partially corrupted data. Give me a sec. Need to ping one of our sats. Let's see which active Dogtown network links to this infrastructure. And putting in a back door. Ready to roll. Hop on the platform. I'll guide you to the garage from there. <laughs> Hang on. Okay, Relic Hack first, then you slap the muzzle on Johnny, now you bring some pile of scrap metal back to life. Serious trickery. Oh, who taught you? B, I'm an NUS intelligence analyst, trained under the best peeps in the biz. And they took me on because around age 13, I got the local ripper to sell me a beat-up old deck. Barely left in it since. I got noticed, the rest is history. I got a feeling story's incomplete. Likely longer. More twisted. Might be. Apologize up front for the quarry, but I gotta ask. Kampeki Plaza Heist. Why? Had a friend. We worked together. Gig was important to him. And he, uh... He was important to you. He didn't make it. He did not. I think so. to hang tight for a sec. By the way, must have gotten old by now. Calling a faded rocker boy around strikes me as tiring. Not a Silverhand fan, are you? Please. Samurai was done by their second album.
Shit! V? President Myers wishes you the best of luck. How's she doing? Awful nice of you to ask. I laid out the details of our plan. Typical Rosalind. Keep me apprised, she says calmly. Just sitting there, sipping her gin, looking through her agenda, postponing meets. Woman's unshakable. Cityside Metro, huh? Reminds me of when I was starting out. I'd look for places like this. Set up a power bypass, jack in. Essentially steal my way onto the net. Grab the riskiest gigs I could find. Learn them as I went. The hard way, usually. But sometimes, a few times, I really pulled off coups. Anything I'd find on BBS gossip feeds? Hmm. Biotechnica in 63 or 4. Fermentation facility in Oregon. Off the grid half. Sound familiar? Hmm. Yeah? Sensing a buzzer. But you're nowhere near impressed. No. No, this is my impressed face. Uh huh. You'll be in Dogtown in a minute. Try to steer clear of Hansen's goons. Speaking of Kurt Hansen, what else do you know about him? Hansen was an officer, Militech. Tail end of the Unification War, his unit was tasked with taking Night City. They managed to secure a foothold in the southmost pocket and stuck around. Refused to demobilize, laid down their weapons, found in Dogtown instead. Traded one conflict for another, basically. Hot or cold, no better way to make a buck than war.
up the stairs through storage. You should pop into the market. Radical mods, Jim. Never seen anything like that on a non maelstromer uh, You mean this? Ain't seen nothing yet. Check this out. Or oh, this shit here. <laughs> what happened? Some kind of accident? There's a bunch of theories. Cyber psychosis, childhood accidents, mind blast, body dysmorphia. Take your pick. Which one's the real one? Whichever one's gonna land me a sale. <laughs> uh, and speaking of, uh, how can I help? Cream collection. You ain't scared something will go off on its own. I'm jacked into all of them. Feedback loop, cohesive connections, and all that. Chill. All of these are your peripheries? Not afraid of an overload? <laughs> me? <laughs> afraid? No, 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 no way. Uh, maybe. Anywho. <laughs> Uh, don't want the gear to get cold now, do we? Hey, check out this bad boy. Rostovich DB2 Satara. The word is, this gym named Brick owned it. Where'd you get that piece? Hey, a good deal never reveals their sources. I'm all about the lost, the found, and the kinky. Make all your lethal dreams come true. Heard wild stories about this place. Among vendors in Kabuki, it's downright legend. Seems the legend's true. Stalls here? Just the tip of a mammoth iceberg. Dive deeper and you'll find a truth that's much darker, even downright disgusting. The heavy stuff, biggest deals, take place behind closed doors. Dogtown stadiums where the right buyers meet the right sellers. this up. You should have supplied those... Watch it! A life that couldn't work. Fortunately, I didn't have a choice. And, and it's not like it was free. They forced us to buy them on credit. 20 year installments. Fixed to ourselves. We took in a face plate. And we rake in the damages. But, then a year later, NAA went on to This is Kurt Hansen. If you're hearing this, you've come to the right place. 
NCPD gang wars, not in Dogtown. Taxes, who the fuck needs them? In Dogtown, I keep your business safe as long as you abide by my rules. Sound fair to you? I thought so. Good. Hey, you there. Yes, I'm talking to you. Are you getting what you want out of life? Let me guess. Food from a tube, rusty water from the tap, another murder outside your bedroom window. What if you can leave all that? You have any idea how much it costs to raise two teenage girls in? Oh, hey. In a market dominated by arms deals and tank sales, you sell clothes. Ah, not just any clothes. Only the finest knockoffs of the finest brands. From Avanti to Giovanni Brizzi. And how is Biz? Fine, fine for now. But my son's an athlete. If I just say the word, we have a chance to leave Dogtown. An athlete? Where's he trained? There are places. Looking for some preem threads. Then you're in the right place. What's inside this mysterious Militech container? Only vendor GMCT87 will know for sure. But don't you worry, the next auction of original corporate commodities will start in a few minutes. No risk, no if they catch us in the end. Why do you ask? Just been on my mind since I patched in. Maybe because I've had your biomon feed floating in front of my eyes all the time. Sorry. Don't fret. Relic will do me in, sure, but not before I save you and Myers. <sighs> not, uh, what I... I just want things to work out for you. You're fighting for yourself. Your life. Deserve another shot. Nice to hear. Hope you're right. Chin up. We're in this together. There is that. Fuck dog. 
Big Heads' personal protection takes five minutes and a handshake to lock down. Shake, go shake. I don't fucking care. I'm up to my neck and shit. I know it goes deeper. So no time to waste. You gonna help or not? Relax. Put in a word to the right ears. Then Hanson's gotta give his nod, or your shit'll go even deeper. I... I can pay. I, I will pay. Uh, yeah. And it costs more than you think, Chun. Much more. Whatever you need, man. It's yours. Even toss something in for expediting matters, huh? Ah, Cheers. will you now? Okay, stay here, peruse the goods, dry your pants. I'm gonna let you know in an hour. Junkie. Who's gonna check? Chill, man. Fuck, you're so chill. What's over to the hotel? All right. Time we got up on the roof. The hell for? For the view. And I'm not being coy here. I mean, you'll see where we land, literally. I don't remember. People look like the fools. Oh, they did, but out of sight. What now? Try and restart the generator. You upset or something? I detest wrinkles like this. When things don't go as planned. Yeah, forget about it. Chunk upon junk here. Finally. Pop in. Elevator's roof now.
FYI, we're about to cross into Night City airspace. President's holding up. Well, she's calmly, coolly securing her documents. Third or fourth time, though, so I'm clearly not the only one who's stressed. You made it. Good. What now? The calm before the storm. See that? It's us. Space Force One. We're descending. In for a rough... Oh, fuck. What? What's going on? Songbird, thought you might have... Fuck! Yeah, I know, I know. Song of the cat. Life number nine commenced. Alas. I made sure to get Myers to the safe room before I ejected. Run to the wreckage fee. Save her! Right. On my way! Just be careful. Hanson said his goons. You need to hurry. What then? Got a plan? Find Myers? Get her to Liz Crescent. It'll be the safest spot in Dogtown right now. Right. I'll be in touch. Godspeed, me. Focus now. You won't pass this way without a fight. You're capable, I know, but I'd rather not take any chances. So stay low. Go around.
on board, killing myself and Wasman. How many still alive? No idea. Must be some way I could... Wait, I got it! The crane arm! Hop on! I think I can boot it up. Not a second to spare now. Across the roof, right straight ahead. Steady, steady. Enemy backups on the way. We got any West agents there, not bogeys. Someone shot me!
Get inside quick. Fuel tank's insulated. It won't explode. See anything? A whole lot of wrecked aircraft. Anyone alive? Nobody jumping out to greet me. Shit! Are we too late? Deep breaths. Nothing's for sure. Me scan around. Keep moving back. You'll see a safe room. I'll pop the release on the door. One move! Who are you? You have five seconds! Rosalind Myers? You're looking at the solution to your current problems. Name's V. Uh, corny as it sounds. My favorite letter of the alphabet just now. Apologies. I had to be sure it was really you. Great. Let's Delta. <laughs> Back. 
message to you. Thanks, Chi. Bloodstains can be removed using one easy trick and vinegar. Hold your position! You there? V, how's the sitch? We're alive. Both of us. Now listen, head for the vacant building on- Elizabeth Cress. Got it. <coughs> Give me some credit. It's the best place to lay low. No heat signatures, so it's empty. Not a soul inside. Now get moving. Got Songbird on comms. She's fine. Found us a safe house nearby, too. Songbird. I'd started to worry. I suppose I forgot she always lands on her feet. That crazy look. Both of you. Huh. Maybe you brought it with you. People dead. All of them. Because of me. Nightmare. Sure. So wake up. Look alive! As if it were that easy. You have no idea how deep this goes. We were hacked. It means Hansen had help. From Washington. The NUS government is aware of the crash, no doubt. They'll have sat-mapped it, seen us hit the ground in Dogtown. Unless... Unless the plot goes deeper. Hansen spreading his agitprop lies as we speak. I'm sure of it. Our people will have an even harder time crossing the border. Understand your concerns. Don't forget you got me here, though. You? And Songbird. We'll get you out of this mess. Thank you, V. We stick to the plan. After that, I guess we'll see. Wait a second. Damn it! If Hansen's got someone inside in Washington, that means I'm traceable. Wherever, whenever. I have a subdermal tracker. It needs to go ASAP. It's near an artery that's best not nicked. I'll need your help. Chipping the prez with the tracker? Weird. Safety precaution. In case I ever wanted to ditch the White House, go on an all-night bender. Can you help? I assume you know what you're doing. Be completely on your own without the tracker. Well, you're here. Almost a rite of passage. Feel like I'm welcoming you into the clan. <clears throat> Uh, a clan? Quite the career change you've made. Uh, wait, is that... 
drone. Finish up, quick. Cover it now. That was close. V? I'm here. Right on time. You in one piece? For now. Can't say I'll stay that way. We need to get to the top of the building. Talk later. Got Songbird on comms. Says we gotta climb higher. Lead the way. It's your city, after all. Kurt's hounds have caught your scent. You need to move. Delta time. Let's go. We'll ask our guardian angel if she can get this elevator moving. All's okay at your end? Where are you operating from? Well, not from a cool comfy ice bath. God knows what I get for that now. I'm nearby, though. Just had to find a new nest, or they would have found me. Elevator could use a runner's touch, Song. Already on. Huh. Sorry, V. My magic's no good here. What we need's power. There's a maintenance shaft with a fuse box nearby. Follow the scaffolding. Says I need to turn the lights back on. Might take a minute. Fine, I'll keep my head down. place to get stuck. Just one way to find out. What's the probability a random passerby noticed a moving elevator in an abandoned hotel? <sighs> right. Leave the analytics to Songbird. Little fuckers are fidgety. Sharp sensors on those. If they've sensed us already, the place will be swarming in no time. Great reason to move on and keep moving. My thoughts exactly. And mine. Just stay calm and keep quiet. Hold. Drone on your left. Well controlled. I touch it, I give away your position. Something best avoided. Restaurant. Subnet access point in there. If you jack in, I can inject some fake hostile readings. Send the drones chasing after geese. Doable. I think we'd do best to sneak past them.
drone to do all the work. Now's your chance to slip out. Tiptoes recommended. Care to tell me what the fuck is going on? We have a plan we need to stick to. Elizabeth Crest Street. That's where you need to go. The streets are too hot. You need to go underground. You'll take old metro tunnels. Find the nearest station beneath an abandoned exit hall. Got it. Scumbags won't run up. Lose them before accessing the garage. Fire to me, drop!
Sector 2 1. Investigate now. According to traditional Christian doctrine, you are going to burn in hell. Outpost. Best go around. Yo, patrol. The fuck's going on? Waiting on a sig. Oh, you gawk has let her run. Now heads are gonna roll. Yeah, like that. Over and We're out. gone. Good thing you grabbed the wheel. Looks clear. Finally. Nice change. Dogtown. What a joke. Did you all nuke this place? You all? First time I'm here. Likewise. And if I never make it back, it'll be too soon. like a kind of museum. <laughs> a museum of wishful thinking. Where the rich bought and sold so many unfulfilled dreams. Building seems to be in good shape. For dog town, at least. Strange, isn't it? Maybe Hansen found some rich fools to fund his whims. No need to delay. So quiet, I can hear my chrome creak. Quiet's a good sign. You think so? I generally prefer lively places. Feel free to ask her about those exhibits. Really wonder what she'll say. No way around this? Songbird, got a sitch. Can you jimmy the door? <laughs> On it. Oh, the lock jammed. Gotta brute force it, B. Time to roll up your sleeves. No need. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. 
Head for the elevator, just across the room. Huh. One of Hansen's warehouses, it seems. Gotta find an elevator, other side of the room. This is no time to stop and think. This is no time to stop and think. What is it now? Let's move, please. Here goes. V, do you hear that? Shit, bastard's caught up to us again. Songbird? Hey, bad news this time. Hansen's dogs caught your scent. Assault incoming. They must have geolocated the car you jacked. What now? We've got a surprise for our guests. Making the final adjustments now. Need that. Myers, we gotta engage him. Song's on the case. Nice B. You should think about joining up. Keep up the fucking <clears throat> uh. Starting to heat up in here, Songbird. Working on it. Hold on tight. Uh. I will not be surrounded. Almost there. Still melting that progress. Uh, you're down! Possessions! Uh. Oh, 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 Where the hell they get iron like that? Bird, what's with you? What the hell is going on, V? Dunno, Song's having a fit or something. Quick! Through here! 
play rough, gonna get rough. You're not dying on me today. <sighs> no. <clears throat> Guess not. Right. Good. You okay? Injured at all? Nothing serious. I got lucky. Can't stay here. Are you mobile? Destroy you. Hey, waiter! Watch the laser!
destroy you.
My ass. <sighs> Close call, Matt. <sighs> Good teamwork. And luck. A pile of luck, V. Grab what you can, and let's head out. There has to be an exit here, somewhere. Try this one. Hmm. What's this? Good stuff. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Dead quiet. Still. Not good. Come on! Fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? Hold up, V. Let's pause. Think for a sec. What's eating you? I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Okay, gonna give it a shot. I need a songbird. Starting to worry us, girl. Song, are you there? No answer, girl. Guess you got me and only me. Great to see you again, Johnny. Curb the enthusiasm, kid. Never know. Could need me. So? Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. What happened back there? With so me? Something was off for sure. Could say she got hit with a demon, maybe tripped a defense protocol on the Chimera's ice. Could say? Mm-hmm. If Songbird was a cookie-cutter runner. Both know she's not, though. Damn fucking straight. But who knows? Nah, whole thing was a clusterfuck. You know, no net run comes without a burn risk. No. Impossible. Somi's had occasional off moments lately. Temporary slumps. But I'm sure she's headed where we're headed. Same destination she gave us. It's the reasonable thing to do. Right. Reasonable. Girl's gonna have a hell of a hangover. If she wakes up. How you figure that? Cause I wound up at the same rave she went to. Felt like I was underwater. Leagues down. Tried to surface, but this suffocating, sucking sound pulled me back in. Then when she lost control of the... 
Chimera. The water turned into fucking boiling tar. Seems like the Sitch spiraled out of control. Amen to that. Though actually, could have been a straight overload. Seen runners caught in those. Shit's ugly. So, can we move on? Southwest now. Feels like we're circling back. Uh huh. Song mentioned an abandoned building. Place to lie low. No heat sick, so should be relatively safe. I pray you're right, so me. Pushable, you think? Could use a little help. Of course. Oh! A damn fork? Well, we didn't account for this. Which way now? Thoughts? Hmm. Let's try this way. Looks promising. Cameras? Here? Hansen's a military man. He loves control and hates blind spots. Great. Huh, our stop. On the right, see it? Here's where we surface. Christ, finally. Mm, I'm gonna smell musty for a week. So good. But the faster the better. Elizabeth Chris Street. Bull headed Betty. That's what we called her. Re elected nine times. She must have had her ass well into that city. Funny how she has her own street in Night City. That jealousy I'm detecting? Please. Jealous of what? What's the matter? Are you hurt? Yeah, I could say that. <clears throat> Old wound. One that literally has you on the floor. Got an... experimental Arasaka biochip in my brain. It's killing me, literally. Somi says she might have a solution. Wait, you're talking about the relic. That'd be the one. A secretive tech someone stole from Arasaka. 
On the day Saburo lost his battle with mortality, no less. Bingo. So that's how she could reach you. That also goes a long way toward explaining the nature of your deal. I appreciate the candor. Seems it's all for one and one for all, if we're to survive. Expect in more trouble? Tonight? I expect nothing but. It's best to be prepared for any contingency. Okay, this is us. Eight. Great place for an ambush. Hopefully no one else thinks so. One, two. Pitch fucking black. Where are you, so me? Huh, guess we got here first. Seems so. We'll have to sit tight. Though I assume we'd rather not sit in the dark. How would it be useful? We could also get the radio up and running. What? Can't miss our daily dose of fear-mongering? We need to know the situation on the ground. Check this, V. Attempted postmodern art. More like a home-cooked generator. Maybe we kickstart it, literally? Uh-huh. Old Thornton engine, pretty run down. A little bit of chew left too. If the fuel's not degraded, it could actually run. But can't start it. Not without a power source. Sure, but seeing as we got a lull in the lead pouring down on us. Listen, got a bad vibe about this. You? That makes two of us. Gig's got too many twists and turns. Songbird, S-tier netrunner, promises a panaceum, a cure-all, then gets wiped off the map. Myers, shady politico, got a dagger thrown at her back all the way from Washington. Who by, and why? Fuck if we know. Oh, plus Kurt Hansen and his fucking Sam launcher. Just preem. Got this hot itchy feeling in my groin. Like someone's not fessed up to something. One thing's sure. Plot runs Mariana trench deep. We'll cobble together the full picture. Piece by piece if needed. More like rest in pieces. Us both. Anyway. Let's get this power sitch sorted.
Should do the trick by my eye. In you go. Fire it up. Fingers crossed. Here it goes. And maze balls. Look what I found. What do you say? There's more in the fridge. Feel free. You earned it. New look? Great. Right? Should draw less attention, too. Grab a gulp. Just earned yourself a vote, Madam President. Are you even registered? Housewarming gift from Songbird, maybe? <sighs> Wouldn't it be wonderful? And circling back to Night City, speculative chatter continues tonight around the downed passenger craft. And U.S. representatives claim President Rosalind Myers was aboard when catastrophe struck. City officials have yet to release any statement. However, one all-too-familiar figure did decide to speak out. Kurt Hansen, the self-proclaimed leader of Dogtown, called a press conference earlier today to offer his take on the situation. I'm being framed. Isn't it obvious? The NUSA's been out for my blood for years. Now I'm not without flaws. But another thing I'm not is suicidal. An attempt on the life of the head of the NUSA? What transpired in Dogtown is no trivial matter. I urge you all to consider the true motives behind this... spectacle. The NUSA will take any excuse it can get to send forces into Dogtown. And will they stop there? <laughs> no. You, good people of Ninth City, are next in the fucking line. Shit. Mark my Fuck words. This. Troglodyte's clever. Maybe too clever for his own good. Bull to the shit, nobody's buying that. Oh, they're buying it all right. Reporters even talking to him is the first sign. Night City's public enemy number one, given a full press spread. What a fucking joke. Some mysterious party's out to trigger war. An attempt on my life's a damn good case of spell eye. All the more reason for us to stay put. Got plenty of mysteries to solve. Songbird, Washington, Hanson. To name a few. Agreed. Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird. Maybe. Can't be sure, though. It's our lucky day, Chumba. A penthouse with a view of the city. And lights that work. No, this doesn't feel right. None never does with you, does it? Fucking Killjoy. You want an angle on Hanson's airdrops? You got it. V, we need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. I'll be dead. Wait. Wanna try talking first? I hope you know what you're doing. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Just looking for a place to hold up for the night. This one's taken, clearly. Told you. So I see. This, the uh, presidential suite. <laughs> Shit. Word is, they a bounty on the head of Rosalind Myers. What we gonna do about that? Come on, guys. Let's figure something out. We don't want any problems. Iron in my face, say otherwise. This iron will stay silent, so long as you do. Now that's an idea. But our silence ain't come cheap, yeah? Whoa. Pump the brakes, man. 
Not now, Tay. I was negotiating. Do you remember negotiating with Hanson? What happened? Not now. You negotiated with Hanson? What was that about? That small misunderstanding. They macheted his leg off. You motherfucker. <sighs> was a conflict of interest. Colonel Dipshit don't appreciate motivated entrepreneurs like myself. Now my question is, what can you offer us that's better? You lost, Chum. Last I checked, we're in Dogtown. Don't tell me it's you two against the town here. One little misstep in your scop. Would you rather die in Dogtown? Or find yourself a nice place across the city line? Your choice. Jacob. And what's that supposed to look like, exactly? There's enough space for four. Should be easy to stay out of each other's way. But if any uninvited guests arrive, we'll be counting on you to stand with us. This is your chance. There won't be another. Shit. But it might could be our last. You got a deal, Madam Prez. And... Want me a ray feed? Jesus Christ. Uh huh. Any model in particular? Shit, my ass will fit them all the same. Tell me where you want it parked. Will do. So long as your bodyguard don't slit our throats come nighttime. Well, V, do you plan to slit these two gentlemen's throats? It all depends on you, Chooms. Gonna have my eye on you. Likewise, Choom. Well, all fucking right. We got us a deal. I like to celebrate new Chooms by tossing back a few, but T and I gots to be sharp. Airdrops come morning. Gotta get up early. Same here. Come on, V. It's been a hell of a long day. Watch the master and learn, T. Watch and learn. You're gonna get us killed one of these days. Maybe. But at least you'll kick it with a smile on your face and your balls in the right place. What's up, V? Shoot some shit with me? Then spill it, girl. Working for the press. What's it like? Feds probably pay stacks, yeah? Every hour brings new challenges. Can't tell you more than that. Yo, no doubt, no doubt. Hang with the right peeps? I bet the whole world opens its legs. Business trips, Lux hotels, Joy Toys on demand, Ganic meat, happy hour in orbit. I mean, shit! Like a fucking rock star. Like a fucking rock star. Anyway, you made a wise choice for an overnight. Safe, out of the way. It's even got work and power. Mentioned airdrops before. What's that about? It's like this. Colonel Hansen runs a big market, but he's landlocked, right? Gotta get his shipments in somehow. Talking iron, ammo, meds, fucking anything. All falling out of the sky and into Kurt's lap. Now, if you know where and when to look, might fall into your lap instead. Feel me? Telling me finders keepers. Clipping from Kurt. It's kid stuff. Trickle down economics, I call it. So... One thing I don't get. Building safe, right? So why is it a total ghost town? Right. Well, that's because it's haunted. But don't worry, baby. You safe with me. Jacob. It's true. A lot of peeps died here. Mysterious circumstances. Like an aneurysm, each and every one. One time, 12 runners they found. All their brains fried. Hanson closed the house down. Banned entry. And the colonel's word means lots more than some turrets and shit. Folks know to stay away. 
So what are we still doing here? Cause fuck them, that's what. And fuck urban legends. Looking for someone. Asian American woman, about 30. Seen anyone like that? Well, it doesn't ring a bell. But shit. <laughs> You can't ask you to meet at a bar like a normal chew? You pull the night shift? Well, we could call it my part of the deal. And an old habit from the Badlands. Badlands. My old stomping ground. Which family you in? None now. I took an exit ramp off the road, you life. How come? I sold my people out to the Raffins. Fourteen family dead in an ambush at Tipton Peak. Heard enough? Heavy, Jim. Well, you asked. I'm the one who has to live with it. Finally. My legs are killing me. Come on. Take a breather. Still nothing from so me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. How you feel about our roommates? None too bright. But not entirely useless. And two extra guns could always prove handy. I gonna give him that payday, really? Why wouldn't I? They're taking a sizable risk. So, what if Songbird don't show? We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well... Then... I'll have one other option to consider. Let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. <laughs> Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, a glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. <sighs> See you in the morning, V. She's on the balcony. Help yourself to some coffee. I made it fresh. Where's Jacob? Fresh airdrop nearby. Jay went down for a look-see. Sleep okay? Night all right? Like any with a roof overhead. Claustrophobic. As for Jacob, he thrives in dreamland. Come on, baby. Ever ridden in a ray field? My villa with VIP friends? High society? On and on till the crack of dawn. A uh, man with ambitions, clearly. Those in a deviated septum. She's not here. Means she's not coming. Been, what, 12 hours since the crash? Enough time to flee Dogtown, that's sure. She'd never leave me behind. Protocol? Friendship. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Could it still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Listen, no, we had a calm night, but you gotta leave Dogtown. How? In a car trunk? Fingers crossed? Hansen's waiting for that sort of desperate attempt. Okay, gotta be away. Let me think. Uh, 
No, my share of fixers. Bet we could get one though. Out of the question. They'll hand me over to the highest bidder. Gotta find her myself, sounds like. On my own. Not entirely. I have just the person to help. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intelligence efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. Sleeper agent. No shit. Tell me more. Unless it's like a state secret or whatever. It is. Of the false bottom drawer variety. Let's say you want to secure your interests on another country's soil. If diplomacy fails, you resort to other means. Like a military coup? That's one option. Solomon Reed is another sure one. Reed guy sounds like an ace up your sleeve. Could have played him already. Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. A what now? Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. You mean an, an analog landline? That crashed your open a hole in space-time? When sending sensitive information, you use the technology least vulnerable to interception, old or not. That Caliente should still be wired for it. Owner have a thing for antiques? He had a thing for federal money. And he might still be alive. Remember, 0931. Okay, seems doable. And I prefer discretion to destruction. I trust that's clear. Mm-hmm. So what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the? The file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Telling me I'm a special agent now? That's right. But taking the oath make it feel more real. Secret comms line, presidential token, what's next? A coded message in today's scream sheet? That token is for your safety. If Reed isn't 100% certain I sent you, he won't hesitate to kill you. Yeah, no, let's skip the formal thing. Is there a problem? It's just a big commitment, you know? Can't swear to something I don't believe in. It's your choice. I understand this was sudden. Good luck out there, V. And don't let the bastards nab you. Supposed to go to the local Capitan Caliente. Know the place? <laughs> it's not my top choice for hair of the dog. But it closed down. The business went under and the owner chose the rope. The right call not taking that fascist ass oath. Oh, yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. Yeah, yeah. Fuck the system, fuck our Osaka, fuck the NUSA. Jesus Christ, V, this ain't some teenage anarchist boot camp. No, I was once at Corpo Jarhead, right? Practically dove into uniform head first. They had a real hard on for the oath. Repeat after me, bloody fucking blah. But can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. Sure you want to talk about this? 
Gotta hand it to you, V. Wiser than I was back in the day. Away. See that crazy color smoke? Yep. Wham bam. One of Hanson's cargo drops, no doubt. She all yours. I sure as shit ain't making that climb. Don't wanna climb, or you're not telling me something. You think I'm finna parkour up on one leg? Well, thanks for the heads up. Maybe I'll take a look. Sure thing. again with my favorite merc this side of the Sierra Nevadas. I uh, only did the one gig for you, far as I recall. Hmm. And let's not forget our torrid tale of Haitians, netrunners, and animals. You could not have made contact with the VDBs without me. Your source for adventure I am, in Dogtown as elsewhere. So, we finally gonna meet in person? I can say neither yes nor no. In lieu of an answer, I've new work for you. I hope you'll accept. One last thing. How you breached Dogtown's border, I'm not certain. Though I suspect not via the main gate. Irrelevant in any case. I've secured clearance for your future convenience. Your name and likeness now registered in the system, granting unfettered passage over the district threshold. Talk again soon. Captain Caliente, 
guy clearly went down with this place. Stash house, by the looks of it. Right. Let's see what's here.
Antique. Junky variety. Wonder if it even works. I'll have a double cheeseburg while you're at it. Uh, anyone there? Hello? Fossil's probably busted. Or you flubbed the number. What the fuck do we do now? Call me V. Andrew Jackson, basketball court. Daytime. Noted. Not exactly loquacious, our man of mystery. Could just prefer text. Damn sure I do. sure the tomb said daytime. Only thing we're meeting here is a stray bullet fee. Best seats in the house. Gonna be a game to remember. Johnny Silverhand, basketball fan. That's new. You know what I mean. Another game starting. One where your head's the fucking ball. How do you mean? You're up against seasoned players, whereas you just stumbled onto the court. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, her type is all. Politicians. Worse, armed forces. Saying no to high-ranking <sighs> cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. <clears throat> what? Don't believe me? Never told me about that. Nothing to be proud of. Tore out that chapter. Crumpled it, swallowed it. Our sitch hairballed it back up. One thing I did learn, caked in blood and mud. You even listening? What was that? After every carrot comes the stick. Allow me to illustrate. Every grunt gets a rifle, flak jacket, and a bunch of promises. Comes a time you're out of ammo, Kevlar's tattered cardboard. And what's left of the promises? Fuck all, I'm guessing. Exactly. And that's when they reach for the stick they call values. Getting shelled in your dugout, tombs are taking refreshing phosphorus showers, and some officers ranting about loyalty and duty. The moment you stop shitting carrots and they wave the value stick, fucking run, rabbit. Run.
Sounds like you got some shit to work through. Gotta face your demons sometime, Johnny. Didn't actually have a problem with them. Till now. Politicians, <laughs> military runners, intelligence operatives, and Colonel Hansen for dessert. All the rotten fish in one fucking barrel, this dog town. Don't turn around. Eyes on the court. <laughs> Hands, would you hold him? I see you holding something. Show me. Got this token? Mean anything to you? I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close, this one. Who sent you? A mutual friend. We don't have mutual friends. Friend survived an accident. You might have heard. I might have. Zone defense, that. Keep pushing. Is she safe? Hard to say. Nope, nah. -uh. Don't do that. Just don't. So then. Hard to say. No longer we sit here. That's it. Dribble around it. You followed? Did you even bother to check? Doubt I was tailed. So you didn't check. I see you still got a ways to go. We'll work with what we got. Black Thornton Merrimack, in the street. Three minutes, front seat. That it? Interrogation over? Already? We're starting to have fun. Reed? Slippery motherfucker. I think we really hit it off. Sure. Betty's got candy in that van. Ready to find out? Black Thornton. Before we go, apologies for the precautions. I only ever rest so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Troon's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. Odd introduction, but nice meeting you too, Reed. Not a phrase I often hear in this trade. You're not in the biz, V. Al biz. Actually, I am, though. Just since yesterday. I was about to say your first time's out are the hardest, but I'm not gonna lie. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. Snowman. Back at clan. No longer extent. Now a freelance merc. To make things more interesting, FIA agent. You received a commission last night. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? Songbird hired me. Know her? Saw me. Something up? We used to work together. I thought I heard the last about her, but... That girl's a magnet for trouble. Right. It's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. Address, please. Just FYI, not so sure you're gonna like it. Try me. Abandoned building on Crest Street, 8th floor. Damn straight, I don't like it. You left her alone? In Dogtown? 
Was I supposed to drag her along while cruising around? Actually... Look, place seemed plenty safe to me. Safe? A derelict building in Dogtown. Just listen to how that sounds. Hold up. I need to take this. Why are you calling me on my day off? Last I heard, you're the manager. Ask Bob, he owes me a favor anyway. Yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without me. Boss, man. I work the door at a club. Selection, you know, bouncing. FIA special agent. Bouncing away time in a club. The job attracts ex-cops and commandos, too. I know a few. They're a tough bunch. Trouble. Easy to blend in with over beers. Huh. This is not how I imagine spending my day off. Saving the president? Great action BD shit right there, am I right? Yeah, sure, I guess so. Does my eyes still smoke? Snitches get stitches, man. So that'll be a yes. Not good. When things start to spiral out of control, she's likely to light up. It's high time we help her out. Let's go. Honestly, this is not inspiring confidence. Relax, she ain't alone. Made some new chooms. Locals. Introductions were a little dicey, but she turned on the charm. Probably has her Dogtown campaign staff by now. This keeps getting worse and worse. tried to extract her forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would have gone quietly. Take point. Open up. It's me. Yeah, yeah, coming. Don't move much. Fuck's sake. Again? Where is she? That's enough, gentlemen. Put your tools away, gents. Compare length and girth when I'm not around. You the boss. Are you sure? Look around. Positive. Hmm. You remembered my number. Some numbers you never forget. Never with me, Rosalind. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So, it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. No, Reed. We need to talk first, all three of us. Come on, we should talk in private. The President, a merc, and a special agent walk into the Oval Office. The question is, where do I fit into this joke? You've seen the news. 
Uh-huh. Hansen's spin work never fails to amuse. He's not acting purely on his own initiative. Someone from our camp's propping him up. So, a cast of hawks squawking for war? For some, the war never ended. This shit runs deeper, Reed. I wasn't alone on that flight. I heard so me was on board. Where is she now? V was the last person to talk to her. Most likely scenario? Got caught in some ice on the combat bot when she hacked it. One little mishack happens even to the best, but no way to know for sure. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, we need hard evidence, not speculation. Reed, I needn't remind you what this means for the NUS's national security. Besides, she's your prodigy, Saul. You taught her all your tricks. Hell, even recruited her. She and V have a unique... Uh, bond. It's a lead. Our only one for now. You two have to find her. Together. I already died for the cause once. Not enough? What do you mean you died already? What has my eyes told you about me? Said you'd let an intelligence cell here. Went into hibernation at war's end. So she omitted the fact that Arisak could try to smoke me. <clears throat> and that I ended up in intensive care with three bullet holes. That six months had passed before I could take a shit on my own. Might have slipped her mind. Convenient. Well, now you know. Let me get this straight. You abandon Reed and Nancy. Leave him for dead, and now expect him to jump right back into shit? Newsflash, Madam President. Got a hell of a debt to pay. You're right. I'm sorry, Reed. For those seven years. Is that enough? To get us a fresh start? I'm here. I'll help. But I'm doing it for Somi. In my country. Call me naive if you like. As for you, V. You said in the car a songbird hired you, correct? I don't know how much she's paying, but you better ask yourself, is it worth it? Songbird's my only shot at surviving. Got Arasaka's relic in my head. Slowly, surely poaching my brain. Seems we're all on the same page now, V. Which means we can help each other, too. Agreed. Think so, too, Reed. If we want to find Somi, we gotta dig deep. I mean, actual reconnaissance. No stone unturned. We need contacts, informers not afraid to sing who might see something in it for themselves. You'll need to earn their trust. That big ask in Dogtown won't be easy. I need to arrange a safe passage to Washington for Myers. Expect my call soon, V. Thanks. For everything. Stay safe. And don't let the bastards get you. Same to you, V. May we meet again in more favorable circumstances. Alright, I need to make some calls. It's me. I need a cab. Two people. Long ride. No, no papers. Not this time. 
Yeah, Dogtown. Waterfront. Usual spot. Thanks. Done. We should leave. Best if we weren't together. V, you'll go five minutes after we do. Good luck, V. All good, Jacob? Doggone fairy tale, V. This Rosalind chick, piece of work if I ever seen one. Thinking we might have had a moment. Shame she ain't finna stay longer. You'll have to excuse my friend. He's sometimes excitable. Right. You ought to teach him about the value of initial impressions. At least his kind goes guns blazing. I mean, screw those stab you in the Baxters. So what's the future hold in store for J&T? Two options. We die in Dogtown, or we hit the road, scoot far, far out of here. I guess it comes down to our dear Madam Prez. Will she keep her word? Gonna boost soon. Keep an eye on Jay, will ya? One shitty nanny I'd make. Hey, keep it real, V. Gotta evac soon. Watch yourself out Now there, the Jacob. world better watch out for Jacob. <laughs> Just remember to knock before you enter shady looking dick. See, if I came knocking last night, I'd have missed the chance to meet my babe Rosalind. And you, I suppose. <sighs> That's life for you, V. There's a lesson in all this, don't you think? Special delivery, all good. No uh, delays? Shipped. First leg by sea. 
then by air, civilian craft both. But it got to its destination fast and undamaged. Any developments here? Sniffed around. Did some sidekicks? No word. No sign from our runner friend. Then we redouble the effort, all right? Add another pair of eyes. Alex, former team member. She's in Dogtown, under deep cover. She'll help out. Roger that. Got an address? Longshore Stacks, a dive bar called the Moth. After sundown, yeah? Got it. It says it's trained on any potential shadows. Good news. Yesterday we completed some necessary repairs at the hospital. Two months of hard work have finally paid off. Starting today, the hospital and its staff will be operating under our protection. Any stitches? A new leg? Report directly to Dr. Robertson. That'll be all. If you want my advice? I dumped that pile of human offal. See how he likes being alone. Yeah, maybe you're right. Anyway, better get going. Take care. Chill up, sweet kids. Seeing sunshine round the bend. Just don't you let those bastards walk over you. What'll it be, honey pie? Surprise me. Adventurous. How special coming up. Hey V, you're at the bar. Sure am. Waiting for you. I'll be there momentarily. There's, uh, one thing you should know. Since then, there's legacy shit needs resolving. You know that op seven years back that went south? Well, my eyes left me for dead. The cover story was I sold out to Arasaka. I never told Alex it was a cover. So, things could get tense. You and Alex, two of you were close? I let our cell in the NC was a handler. She wound up stuck here in Dogtown post-war. Thinks it was because I turned coat. Do you see what I'm driving at? Mentioning this sooner never entered your mind? Truly, Reed? Damn it. I'm mentioning it now. I'm nearing the entrance. And there you are. Enjoy, honey bunch. Thanks. First time in here. I got that right? You new to Dogtown? Oh, hell no. I'm looking for an Alex. Like fuck you are. You're on the awfully short list of folks we just don't serve here. Turn the fuck around and get I have a gin and tonic. Make it a double. She's with me. You've got some balls. All right, my people. We gotta close up for the day. Well, I ain't going fucking anywhere. Come on. You serious? Everyone out! Now! Seven! Seven fucking years in this shithole! Cause of you, Solomon Reed! Holy... Sol ain't getting it. 
Maybe you will. Meyer sent us. Got a mission in Dogtown. With him? FYI, seven years ago, this scumbag stabbed everybody in the back. No, seven years ago, I was ordered to go to ground. And you were fed a cover story. I had to take the fall. There was no other way. Expect me to believe you? Just like that? Get the fuck out of my sight, both of you. Hey, I get it. You and Reed got some mutual explaining to do, clearly. Have at it. Then live out the rest of your days in this musty armpit. That's some kind of convoluted threat? No, we actually need you. But maybe you need us more. Fuck this. Need a smoke. Should be fucking ashamed, Saul. Could get tense, he said. Yeah. Yeah. The hell was that? Did, did she just shapeshift? Metatropic cloaking. Perks of the FIA Militech connection. Get to call dibs on their latest gen, cutting edge tech. Let me try this. Give me a minute. You're gonna talk to her. Someone's gotta, and better me than you. <sighs> Couldn't wait till I was done. Could spit and read drink if it'll make you feel any better. <laughs> He'd know. Old dog, got senses, sharp as ever. He can spit news. and make it past him. Yesterday we completed some necessary <laughs> so NUSA is tossing us back into the fire, huh? Ammunition? Yeah, great so. Well, fire away. Serenade me. Any stitches? A new leg? Report directly to Dr. Robertson. That'll be all. You, right now. Am I looking at the real, Alex? What's it to you? I mean, what's the diff? Nobody who's anybody cares about the real Alex. What if I do? Then it's solely your problem. Now, about the mission. Spill. FIA agent went missing. Reed and I are tasked with finding her. And all of a sudden, FIA remembers I exist. You know Dogtown better than any other operative in their ranks. Their ranks? So you're not FIA. Curious. What leverage they had on you. It's personal. Got my own reasons. In this line of work, you'd fucking better. Had mine, too. Ditch the Metroplex ghetto, cesspool of a life. Lo and behold, FIA is offering next-gen chrome and a purpose. Didn't think twice. Not unlike the fix I'm in. Always starts the same way. Do them a favor, they promise one in return. Sometimes even deliver. Then one day... They nail your dick to the wall. This ought mean that much to you? Cause you're clearly hoping to get something out of it. Question is what? Survival. Woman we're after's offering something that could help me. Just gotta find her first. And by coincidence, Myers also wants her. Who the hell is this bimbo? Songbird. Fuck me. 
Gonna take more than one SIG to process that. Is she on that short list of peeps you don't serve here too? Never told you the whole story, did he? What story? Story of a clusterfuck op. One that led to Reed disappearing and me being holed up here for seven years. Here's the list of operatives. Reed, Songbird, and me. Haven't heard this, have you? <laughs> That's just perfect. Tell me you believe in coincidences? Or, fuck it, fate? Cause plug the same variables into an equation, and surprise, gonna get the same fucking result. Shit in, shit out. <sighs> well, you and that hangdog Judas are in luck. Cause I got a nasty habit of repeating the same gonk mistakes. Got conditions, though. You in any position to have any? Still on their payroll. Don't care. Tell Saul I'm done letting everyone walk all over me, expecting me to lick their boots. Way I see it, this is a favor I'm doing, a transaction. Want my back scratched in return. So what's your ask? Monaco. Wanna burn rubber along the Riviera? Drink champagne on a yacht with a fucking duchess. Want a spy's retirement. Diplomatic posting in a warm, gobsmackingly gorgeous place where fruit off the trees is sweet and demand for field work is zero. Think you can manage that? Reed will take you to Monte Carlo himself if that's what you want. Preem. Go back inside, tell him I'm in. Gonna need more nicotine before I look at his face again. Thanks, Alex. So? She's in. Just wants a spy's nice retirement in return. Don't we all? Can't say I blame her. So, heard you need someone to hold your hand, Reed. Take you on a tour of NC's asswart. I came to you because I trust you, Alex. If you say so. Fine. Songbird. Heard we gotta sniff her out. Song's MIA. Probably here in Dogtown. We were linked, comms like. Song ventured into cyberspace, then got attacked. She vanished just after. That's all we know. We need a net runner. Kind who of spends all their waking hours parsing teraflops of data. Might have caught something. You have someone in mind? Wilkie Slider Laguerre. I should have figured. Went rogue a while back. But I know where that little rat nests. I think this guy will be willing to help. Slider? Don't hold your breath. Classic repeat offender, no scruples or principles. Had a titty twist him to work for us. Likely this time you'll just have to twist a little harder. Slider? Care to fill me in? Renegade voodoo boy, murderer turned CI, all around piece of shit. Outside the net, he's blinder than three mice. Damaged occipital lobe. Not even a Kuroshi could mend it. How's an intel agency lose a blind man? Hold himself up with Haitian buddies. Operates a large-scale tech and demon mill. 
think Kabuki's home to Night City's soft sorcerers? <laughs> no, they're just there to push product. Claim Slider dropped off your radar, went rogue. But you know where he is? Why haven't you brought him in? <sighs> I don't know. Maybe I was saving him for a rainy fucking day. Slider wasn't on my list of prios. Not like it's any of your biz. So, we paying him a visit? Slider hides out in a would-be spa in Luxor Heights. Flick you exact chords in two secs. Or rendezvous there. Alex and I have some, uh, catching up to do. Right. Just don't gouge each other's eyes out. Need both of you alive and healthy. So, all those years, where you been? Involved with someone? I was. For a time. It didn't pan out, though. You? You know me. No poor bastard would have put up with me longer in a month. Come on. Stop pretending you would have lasted any longer. Got numerous hobbies. Sue me. Speaking of which, if I know you at all, you ain't dunking and swishing balls anymore, am I right? Only in my neck of the woods. You know how it is. Yeah. Surprised you didn't pack up, go home. Used to go on and on about those fucking tacos. I couldn't have gone home even if I wanted to. As to what kept me here, must have been something. Which begs the question, Reed. What about me? Why couldn't I go home? The only way FIA agents left Night City was in body bags. Not you? No. No, there was a bag with my name on it. Definitely. Just dumb luck that I'm sitting here in one piece. You never believed in coincidence. Still don't. You're right. I don't. special about it fitting isn't it how the prettiest thing here in dog shit town is a monument to the dead still don't get this gonk affinity for symbols and empty gestures come on well that one for you if I wasn't fresh out just now Shit, maybe I am as sentimental as everyone else. When I see those two, Reed, Alex, went through something similar myself. Got a bond, two of them. Took maybe four minutes and they buried the hatchet. See it clear as day. Any shred of friendship they've got left will fizzle out. Not right now, but soon. Could have spilled the truth years ago, stayed tombs. But no, stubborn old Reed had his orders. Mutually exclusive friendship and duty. Matter of fact, they are. Have good reasons to fly the army, Coop. Think how many times you're willing to get burned before you stop trusting someone.
Hmm. Might have a point, Johnny. Replace someone with country or corp. How many times you gotta take a bullet for these motherfuckers in the name of empty promises? Chew on that when you look at those two. This is Kurt Hansen. If you're hearing this, you've come to the right place. NCPD, gang wars, not in Dogtown. Taxes, who the fuck needs them? In Dogtown, I keep your business safe as long as you abide by my rules. Sound fair to you? I thought so. Good. That'll be all. You haven't been waiting long, I hope. Well, guess you and Alex needed a while to catch up. Hmm, yeah. All swell now, though. Let's go. Time's at a premium. They posted lookouts. Go figure. Doubt they'll play nice and just let us in. No harm in talking to him. Might let us through. You look like bad news. Turn around and crawl back to the hole you came from. Looking for a net runner. Not a kind of service we provide, partner. So kindly fuck the fuck off, eh? Managed to hammer shit out with Placide and Brigitte. No doubt I can manage Slider. Ah, so you're the one the city boys have been talking about. Fine, go. Just make sure you behave. Your spooky shit don't impress anyone, Slider. <laughs> Fuck me. Solomon Reed. I would be lying if I said I have missed you. And you? You put Mama Bridget under your spell. Will you be with me as well? Heard about me? Huh. How? Me. My temple. We are one. My eyes and ears are everywhere. This isn't a temple. It's a malicious demon mill. And you're no priest. You're a two-bit bandit and murderer. Murderer? Ha! It takes one to know one. So, what will it be? Will you strike a bargain with me as you did with that bitch, Bridget? Dunno. 
Don't know you yet, Slider. I am called many things. Wilkie Lager, the blind fury of the cyberspace. A dawn in the NUSA's fat ass. Take your pick. Yeah, you forgot to add double murderer and all-around coward. We're here to negotiate, Slider. Cut a deal. If one party is backed into a corner, it is not negotiation. It is extortion. You say tomato, I say fucking deal with it, Slider. Now, cut the shit and do us the courtesy of hearing us out. No love lost between the two of you, eh? Those who speak to read have a strange habit of vanishing or committing suicide. But since you are partners, you must know that by now. Speak your piece. Need some intel. Street says you're the one to get it. Me? <laughs> I am a blind man. I see nothing, know nothing. Cyberspace is my only field of vision. Well, just so happens what we need is one who knows cyberspace. Sees lots in it. Donk, ding, sir. What specifically do you want from me? Just like that? No haggling. I already know this score. The Langley men send a clear message. Soon after SF1 crashed, a runner was attacked while in the net. Attack severed our link. Need to locate her, stat. Ah, so you want one to investigate net traffic on the day of the crash. Got a malfunctioning relic in my skull. That's how she made contact. That help any? Hmm, perhaps. I will need a peek at this trinket in your head. Will be gentle, this I promise. Jacked into a Voodoo Boy system once. Sprung a nasty surprise on me. This was who? Perhaps I know him. Brigitte's attack hound. Placide. That's toting Frank. I would say he not play fair. You would say correctly. I stopped dealing with the fanatics outside the wall a long time ago. Not to worry. My tech is clean, precise. Don't call your doctor. Let us see what we have here. I see traces. Bursts of data in cyberspace. The wake of someone's passage. <laughs> Who dare they mad? This I do not believe. You out of your mind coming to me with this shit. I think Slider just happened on you hanging out in my head. Nah, this is something else. What'd you see? The black wall. It bring only death. Specific, Slider. The woman. Did you know she used the black wall protocol to connect with you? I had no idea, no. Now you do. What's that mean for us? For what we need? How to explain to layman? The net has layers, various vectors for translocation. But there is one thing that must not be touched. The black wall. The woman, she is walking Kicking bomb 
megatons. She go boom, everybody fucked in the ass. Every last one. Miwanwa, it is a dam that protects us, the civilized world, from the strange bets of the cyber wilderness. If your two leg bomb crack the dam down the middle, it will unleash a flood. Wipe us off the map, just like Haiti. Now why you and the Pacifica Voodoo's don't see eye to eye? Because they're poking holes in the black wall? They do not penetrate. Only jerk off next to it. Let Watch try to keep them in check. But you have to be caught in the first place to want to stick your gigit into a live wire outlet. To the AIs, past the black wall, you are no more than a cockroach, a rabbit, a fragment of outdated code with no meaning. This why Netwatch flatline any who put integrity of black wall at risk. It's no laughing matter, my friend. It is a concern for the safety of all. That's why you, my friend, need to restore V's connection to our girl. You are out of your mind. Non-negotiable, Slider. We need to find her. Besides, as long as she's out there, they catch her scent, they catch yours now, too. They'll set their wirehead freaks on to you and your people. So, you'll help me clean this up, cover all tracks, Snip any threads leading back to you and consequently us. Do that, and we'll be square. You'll be off the FIA's hook, too. <sighs> Meld, it's my lucky day. Ever done anything like this before? What? Be the bridge between hosts using the Blackwall protocol? What the fuck do you think, eh? Confirm the data transfer before I change my mind. Here we go. Linked up, talked, didn't mention you were tapping into the black wall. I didn't. You didn't need to know that. Risky as shit, that. I'm putting my life on the line, not yours. Black wall the relic was the only way to reach you after SF1 was hacked. Listen, dude, don't have much time. Hansen's people tracked me down after I res the Chimera. I've been. Not in any danger. Not as long as I behave. Do what I'm told. I need to There's... Spider, Something's going. not right, girl. Ah! Fucking black wall! <sighs> black Sapphire V. Hanson's hosting a huge syndicate. Crash it on the sly. I'll find you. Make sure to tell me. Is everything all right, dude? Poor bastard. It's over. 
He short circuit. Slider. He flatlined because of us. Flatline, period. Need you to come clean. Were you gonna off him no matter what? Questions moot. Slide is dead. What's done is done. So, Songbird. What's up with her? Got the link back up. We spoke. She's fine. Mostly. Needs our help, but she's fine. In one piece. Alright. Give me the deets later. Time to doubt a V. Just because we got in without dropping bodies doesn't mean they'll wave us goodbye. Bon voyage, Slider. They're done for. Got nowhere to run. Sure, I missed this. Let's move on. Find a quiet corner. What did Songbird tell you? She looked sick, almost like... like our Link was hurting her. Surprised? Why? Take Slider. Out of wall, send him up. Huh? Song needs our help, Reed. Hansen's nabbed her, holding her for... reasons. God damn it. I can't imagine any worse news than that. Black Sapphire. Said Hansen's throwing a big bash there. We get in, she'll find us. Any idea what and where this Sapphire is? Over there. See the taller of the two scrapers? Next to the one with the big-ass screen. That's the Black Sapphire. A would-be hotel ended up a failed multi-billion eddy investment. Hansen's fortress, smack in the middle of Dogtown. We can't just barge in. 
Doubt we have anyone on the inside or affiliated who could crack open a door either. Alex and I will pull some strings, run our contacts. We do the same. You know, think of who you know around here. Maybe what will happen on an idea, find a way. No local fixer. Goes by Mr. Hands. Could ring him. Do it. We'll be in touch. Hands, need a favor. Straight to biz. I like it. Aiming to go to an upcoming shindig at the Black Sapphire. Lusting to dance with the devil. V, the place is inaccessible and treacherous in equal parts. You cannot simply walk in uninvited as opposed to, say, Conpeki Plaza. Surely there's some way in. Hmm. I'll need to twist an arm or a leg. Thanks to you, I have a veritable buffet of limbs to choose from. So, doable, you think? You helped to solidify my position in Dogtown. I'm happy to return the favor. We'll conclude this in person. I'll need some hours. Meet me at the Heavy Hearts. Thanks, Hans. Time to go home, Trevor. V. Trevor's parents can finally give their boy a proper burial. Thank you. Truly. Contract closed.
place so play nice hear me got our eyes everywhere Big guests in from the city? Mm-hmm. Almost every day. We get all kinds of traffic in here from peeps looking to settle their biz in peace and quiet. Not many sides us can offer that. What you looking at, huh? Could use a drink. Thanks. Get back to work now. Okay? Okay. Ah, if it isn't V. V, my favorite Merc. Splendid. What you completed for me significantly shifted the playing field vis a vis Hanson. Excellent work, precisely as requested. Come on, Hans. Flattery? Really? Seems a little beneath you. An overused tactic. Agreed. Unnecessary. No, V, this is strictly business. For those who do their work well, praise is a mere restating of the facts. Maybe the one thing I didn't expect. To see the man behind the hollow curtain. The elusive Mr. Hands in the flesh. Not only did you rescue those clowns in blue, you also managed to eliminate Dodger. Calm, collected, and professional. Bravo. You have proven to be a person I can trust. Hence my decision to drop the veil and meet in person. A rare occurrence, I assure you. Were I to have more virtuosos like you, I wager I'd have more than Dogtown in my grasp. Dogtown, Pacifica, then I'd line up the rest, snort, and it'll be done. Working with bona fide professionals, positively a treat. Geeks you had me do. How will they solve your hands and such? Take a boxer. He can't knock out his opponent. What then? He goes to work on the body. Once his adversary's stamina wanes, he looks for his opening, connects fists with jaw. 
I know it may not seem all that clear from where you stand, but the gigs you have completed will allow me to audaciously shift some of the pawns and figures on the chessboard that is Dogtown. Checkmate is but a few moves away. Take it you'd prefer Dogtown with no Hanson at the helm? Hanson wields much power, greedily so. He's also clever. These traits I tolerate, even value, when occurring in isolation. But all at once, no. Especially not in one who grips an entire district in the palm of his hand. It makes business... trying. And arrest you in some tea. It's my own blend. Sure, why not? So, how did this combat zone become Docktown? Do you know? I heard this and that. Something to do with the war? 2069. Colonel Hansen led an operation colorfully called Midnight Storm. The objective? To occupy this combat zone and establish an NUSA staging ground in Night City. Soon after, the sides agreed to a ceasefire. Hansen's force was left to fend for itself. Headquarters, the public, everyone feigned ignorance, pretending Hansen and company were never here. But our good colonel decided to put down roots. He declared this combat zone an NUSA territory. In our terms, he carved out an enclave for himself and went from soldier to arms dealer overnight. Marooned he was. Two weeks for a bullet to reach his brain, everyone thought. But his brain remained intact, and he became a force to be reckoned with. A man whose existence is a threat to many is a dangerous man indeed. So well and good chit-chatting, but what about our deal? Did my part, time you did yours. Ah, indeed, yes. The Black Sapphire, Hanson Stronghold, guarded by elite soldiers. Military quarters are situated on lower levels, while top floors are a decadent haven for the ultra-rich. The building's blueprint was not easily procured, I should say. Hansen guards his hotel secrets as if they were an embarrassing rectal itch. But, given a will, ways are usually found. You help a client of mine, they reciprocate. And I gain latitude. Quid pro quo in full effect. The building plans are yours. I'll even throw in vulnerabilities to watch for. A token of my appreciation. And, though this goes without saying, the data, its source, are completely secure. No one knows you have it. Data leaks, or lack thereof, are the difference between myself and... Say, the late Mr. Deshawn. The Shard. Black Sapphire Info and Blueprints. All nooks and crannies. I trust it's all you need to waltz in and perform your planned pirouettes. Yet a word of caution. Even fully prepared, you'll be marching into a pit full of vipers. Watch your step. Thanks, Hans. I only hope this won't mark the end of our collaboration. Truth be told, a few new assignments seem imminent. Let me guess. More local political gaming? Activity is abundant in Dogtown, and behind closed doors, plots and schemes. Should change ever occur, as it inevitably must, Someone really ought to pave the way for a smooth transition. Nice meeting you. Finally pinning a face on the name. You should count yourself lucky. Few have done so and lived to tell the tale. And V, whatever happens at the Black Sapphire, 
Make sure you come back alive, hmm? You're going where local and international politics mix. Strong currents, both. I'll make sure to plant my feet firmly, then. Later, hands. Reed, got the data shard from hands. Our golden ticket into the Black Sapphire. Perfect. Thank you. No worries. This connection's secure. Catch. It's on its way. And reception. Mm -hmm. I'll pass it on to Alex. And as soon as you're ready, join us at the moth. If I'm not there when you arrive, just wait. Till then. We've got some important guests in Dogtown. Hereby my personal invitation. Stay out of there. <laughs> they will be welcome to the Black Sapphire. The event is invitation only. So invite, keep out if you know what's good for you. That'll be all. <laughs> Shit! Hey, what's wrong? Come on. It's fine. I'm all right. Sit down. How can I help? Really? <clears throat> Starting to get used to it. This the relic? Long story, but yeah, it's pulling a hostile takeover of my brain. You experience them often? These attacks? Don't really keep count, but never know if the next one won't be my last. Wow, rough. No shit. Death's breathing down my neck. Always. I know what that feels like. What do you mean? I never talked about this, you know. I should be saying they tried to kill me. But sometimes it feels like they actually succeeded. Tell me more. Ambush. Attempt on my life seven years back. Yeah, he said. What exactly happened there, Reed? I landed in the ICU. While I waited for some Arasaka goon to come finish me off. I was betrayed. By our people. The FIA. I say betrayed. But I was sold out. Part of a deal, a peace offering, my head on a silver platter, all for a ceasefire. Peace comes at a price. Someone's always got to pay it. Come on, I want to show you something. Hang on. They set you up, yet here you are working for them again? Even deep wounds stop hurting eventually. Scar over. A few years on, they're just a niche. Let's go.
Let's ride down. Where are we headed? On a little trip down memory lane to see some old junk. I still can't believe Alex decided the best place for a bar was right over our old safe house. She's always had a twisted sense of humor. Where's she at? Waiting downstairs? She's finishing up recon in town. We should make ourselves at home till she gets back. It's been dark for seven years, this place. Let's brighten things up again. The end of any war is never pretty. Both sides race to tie up loose ends. A car bomb blew up one of my crew. Another was poisoned. A third got shot in the back of the head while buying a pack of smokes. A couple others just vanished without a trace. Every night we waited for Arasaka agents to come finish us off. I had to make a choice. I chose to dig our heels in. I thought we still had a fighting chance. It was bold. It was stupid. A mix of both. Maybe I just didn't know how to walk away. Let it rest. Or maybe I don't know how to lose. Either way, we managed to save a few more agents. The price for that was yours truly. Say what you want, it sounds like they stabbed you in the back, plain and simple. Saving many of my people in the process. You play grown-up games, you face grown-up consequences. Funny, out of everyone. It was Songbird they asked to pull the trigger. Wait. Yeah. Pulled the trigger as in literally took out her iron and shot you. Not personally, but she unlocked the door for those who came and did. I was leaving the city, heading home. Songbird was still here, in this very room, in fact. He was guiding me on comms, led me straight into a trap. Neutralizing me. The last assignment in Night City. Then she got a ticket home. And yet you're now trying to save her. Why? Because it's the right thing to do. I had plenty of time to examine this under a microscope. Under focus, some things sharpen, others blur. But there comes a point when you just cut through the bullshit and see what's in front of you. Soundbird is still my people, and nothing can change that. Fuck, Reed. Now, my is is a whole nother story. But Songbird, no. I got nothing against her. I miss anything? Some reminiscing. So good. Let's get this show going. I checked up on Slider's contention. Looking at it right, it turns out. I dove into old mission files wherever Somi was involved. They were buried deep, near impossible to access, even with my clearance. Each and every one, the Blackwall. All authorizations, mission orders, personally signed by one person. Rosalind Myers. Wouldn't want to be in her shoes if that shit floats to the top. The NUS is a small country governed by a woman with highly ambitious goals. Sometimes those ambitions went out of reason. But that's not something we need to pour over now. Alex, what do you have for us? Oh, a little of this, a little of that. We'll plan in a sec. 
Say, V. Like playing fancy dress up? Of course. Who doesn't? Mm -hmm. Then you'll like what I whipped up. Managed to learn that some pop megastar is gonna grace the party with a show. Guest list? Expect everybody who's anybody. That includes you. Gonna don fancy outfits and rub shoulders with VIPs. Be warned though, fancy doesn't mean easy. Ready for the deets, V? Let me hear them. Black Sapphire, the most heavily guarded place in Dogtown. Doesn't mean security's airtight, though. V, you're gonna enter through a flooded tunnel system. Got a top-of-the-line diving suit, ought to fit you snug as a glove. Water's maybe a little super toxic. So yeah, be careful. Toxic how, exactly? Hmm, from suspect waste, some sewage leak too. Don't worry, suit's pissing shit-proof. Already know what the hotel looks like. Really, really hard to miss. Flooded tunnels here. That's your way inside. Now focus. You'll reach a terminal at the end, jack in and breach the cams, giving Reed his window to slip into the building. You'll take different elevators up, here. Saul will open a passage to his side. For you ask, yeah, it's the only way. Area could be heavily guarded, so you'll have to be on your tippy toes. Couldn't get clean intel, so you'll just have to be creative. Improvise. You're gonna meet here. Soon as you meet up, you'll doll up like it's prom night and go to the ball. That's where you'll rendezvous with Songbird. All clear? Okay. How are we getting in again? You're swimming in through flooded tunnels. Reed will take the high road after you let him inside. Sound good? Remind me, how do I get Reed in? You'll swim to the other side, find the terminal, jack in, breach the cams, locate Reed, and crack a door. Then you'll take elevators up, Reed will open a path to his side. You'll then sneak past the guards and stroll into the party like NC royalty. Seared all that into your brain? Yup. Prem. Okay, let's talk gear. Take your time. Grab anything you think might be useful. A surprise awaits you in the box. Your iron? Sure is. Her Majesty's been itching to return to active duty. I'd be honored. That reminds me. Hands. What did he want in return for the favor he did us? Wanted to test the waters? See which way the currents were flowing. Hansen's dominance over Dogtown doesn't benefit Hans' know-how, so he's out to level the playing field. Politics. It's the same shit wherever you go. You know, if not for you, we'd have no way of getting into the Black Sapphire reaching Somburg. It's good to have you on our side. I mean that, V. That it? We set? I believe we are. I'll hang back a while, and then meet you there. Place stinks of memories, huh? A little dusty, but well preserved. What are we gonna do with it once I'm on the Riviera? Gonna lock yourself in here, fondle all this old dead tech till your balls shrivel up? Burn it to the grounds what we'll do, and never come back. 
Now that I like. to Dogtown for her. Turns out she's here chasing her ex. There's prices in Dogtown. Certified resale.
Chiatu. In seas, just a bunch of Reed, you copy? Made it to the hallway. Copy you loud and clear. I'm in position too. Remember, the water is highly toxic. Suit up before you get in. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
outpost. Approaching warehouse gate now. Sure am. I'm at the warehouse gate. You'll need to secure the area, crack it open from the other side. Read. I told you to pack essentials only. No, goddammit. We gotta split before dawn. Already told you. But these need deliverance, you Not through here, they don't. VIPs only. So where am I supposed to... Do I look like the fucking hotel receptionist to you? Literally. Other answer. Liquor boxes and stuff. Ah, there you are. What's the sitch? See a gate. Two guards. Don't worry about them. Give me open that gate. There you go. I've acquired elevator access. Come right to the top. 
Get moving. I'll meet you there. Roger that. Someone was fucking around here. I think we got visitors. Scared of him? Hasn't. The man's repeatedly told both the NUSA and NYC to go fuck themselves. He should have been put down long ago. Instead, he rules this entire district. No, so you are scared. This is Hanson's surf. He has the upper hand. It's just a fact that needs accepting. Does it mean I'm shaking at the knees? Hell no. Find a vantage point to have eyes on me. Neutralize any and all threats. Call and quiet. Drop the sniper. Nestin in his perch now. At the perfect vantage point, saw everything. Cover me. You're in prime duck hunting position. New user detected. Calibration in progress. Firing mode inactive. I'm in position. Do you have a visual on me? I got you. What now? We do this nice and quiet if we can, got it? Spot any guards in my way, give me a heads up. Don't worry, boss. 
Rifle sports a silencer if it comes to that. Better look around. Got a mine just past the corner. Well spotted. I could have missed it. Healthy smattering of guards along their path. Copy that. We'll take them out one by one. Best if they never knew we were here. Cam's galore here. Should have access once the sniper's nest completes calibration. Good. They could prove useful. See the main elevator shaft. Too risky. There'll be sentries up top. Keep an eye on it, though. See a bunch of containers. Could use them to get to your side. Yeah, see them too. Let me build that bridge. There's a service elevator nearby. We'll take that up. Gotta get there first, though. Cover me. Calibration complete. Firing mode active. Don't forget, hallway's mine. Besides that, the coast is clear. Understood. Moving out. Fine work. I can't see around the corner. All clear? Am I okay to move on? Patrol incoming. No can do, chica. Copy that. Moving towards that cover. Broke too. Well, I guess it's time for a little walk around the block. Calm and quiet.
see a bunch of cables. I'll see where they lead. Generator. Got a visual. Kill it. Sensor disabled. Good work. Proceeding forward. Surveillance system link established. I need an assist. You take the guard on the left. The one behind the wall's mine. Got a clear shot. On my mark. Three, two, one. Good job. Let's keep moving. Heads up. Sizable patrol headed your way. Copy that. Moving towards cover. Hey, how's our scav different from an onion? <sighs> How? Don't cry no tears when you slice and dice them. Moving out. Sniper. I think he spotted me. Do of him stack. Come out! Let's end it! Good work. Proceeding forward. Shh, slow down. I have a visual. Thanks. I'm in position. Guards in view. You need to take him out. See that cam above me? We can flip it on him. Camera's mine. Good. Tag out target and fire. The rifle should punch right through that wall. You there? Guards down. Smooth work. Control incoming. Let's go. The guards could have spotted me, V. I need you to deal with them before they're on me. Don't got time for this! Out! Now! Finish it, V. Contact! We've been spotted. Have to blast our way through. Fuck! I got a few bogeys on my six!
your scope. that up like a bunch of rookies, but there's no going back. Elevator, follow me. Almost there, B. Fucking finally. Looking a little pale. Little deja vu is all. Different elevator, different hotel. The sits didn't turn out great. What makes you say that? It's my job to notice things like this. How many ops you been on? Ballpark. One of the number of years you've been around. But right now, we're crashing the party of a bad boy dictator. While aiming to walk out with his prized possession. Dress up time. Throw on your new threads and plaster on your best fake smile. A party awaits. Set. Care for some champagne. Don't mind if I do. A pleasant evening to you. Gang bosses? Well, Hansen's clearly made it. It's literally as if he's defecating truffles and caviar while they're all lined up. This is gonna hate plates up to his arse investigation. I mean, they want to gobble up by server, especially for us. Is 
Saluda, mía. Appreciate it. Thanks. You watch. Hans here jerk us around for hours, or try to. Thinks the booze and ambience softens us up. Makes us more pliable for when we sit down to negotiate. I don't think I care either way. We have one job. To get 2,000 bombs and vagrants out of this dead How we get it done? The bosses don't care. Hiring Hans and Hans to be cheap is no problem. His price is the lowest. Just structure. What do you think you're doing? I don't care. Thanks a lot. This isn't about who has the right credentials. Aim to get fucked up on Hansen's dime and puke all over his carpets? Respect. Of the zone because of a few Trump's slogans? That's not what I mean. He needs to be shown his projected profits and losses in plain writing, without any sugar coating. So you think I'm sugar coating? You signed a contract with Night City, well done. Just leave Hansen to me, because, no offense, I know you'll find a way to cock it up. Ah, the dream of restoring Pacifica to its intended glory lives on. Overheard some investors. Ready to watch their cash disappear into Hansen's pockets. Brave of them. torture-based debt collection. Shit sounds bad as is, but they actually managed to turn the horror up a notch. Watch it. So, Kurt Hansen, Duke of Dogtown, in the flesh. More mud than alpha hell, it looks like. Warning people about the relic? God's light shining upon you. The 
Even the pastor warning peeps about the relic on the feeds made an appearance. Maybe he's here to save Hansen. We'll all collect donations for his church. At the end of the day, that money's still money. What now? I know as much as you do. All she said was to come here. She'll either find us or she left us something. And you, what's your play? I think I'm starting to feel the vibe. Just remember what we're here for. To my right, Booth's far back behind the stairs. The guy in the fatigues. Looks like he came here straight from a firing range. Owner of the Black Sapphire, Mr. D-Town himself, Kurt Hansen. Clearly having a great night in the company of the NCPD commissioner. PA Broadcast. He's fiercely anti-law enforcement. It's an act. Behind closed doors, he's rubbing elbows and patting the backs of NCPD's top brass. Avoid him, especially in the confrontation. Beside that, stay visible. Songbird said she'd find us here. Let's give her a chance. I'll grab a drink and look around. Open line on comms. Don't press it one too hard. We need to keep Did up you for a drink? Look like you're having fun. Gin and tonic, please. Hey. I'm looking for a friend. You're supposed to meet me here. Huh. Okay. Does your friend have a name? Song Sony. Korean lady. Around 30. Hmm. Might have seen her around. On this floor, I think. Was she alone? Was she? No. No, she was with Colonel Hansen, I think. But he's in sight with other people now, and she ain't one of them. Yeah, I can see that. Have one on me later, yeah? Thanks. As you wish, sir. V, it's good you're here. Not what you expected, huh? Is it the haircut? All the chrome on you. How you appear via the relic is... A vestige of the past. From a time when I still wasn't. See, the black wall... It's hard to explain. Each connection, penetration, comes at a price. It's so good you're here. Don't know what I'd do without you, V. Really. Good to finally meet you in the flesh, face to face. The way our last combo ended was... troubling. The, uh, runner. Your friend. Who, who helped us reconnect last time. Killed him. Fried him, didn't I? You didn't kill Slider. Blackwell did. Lucky as hell it didn't flatline you too. I ran out of time. To explain... Everything. Saul. I've made... So many mistakes. It's alright, Saul. Not your fault. The blame's on us. All of it. On you? I is all of them. I know what they made you do. They pushed and pushed, and I... <sighs> I wasn't there to stop it. Listen, guys. We do not have the time for this now. Right. Main thing is to get you out of here. That's... not happening. It is. We got in, we can get out. Just Not the me. point. I'm dying, Saul. Like V. Hansen has the cure we need. We run now, we both die. Relic's killing V. Blackwall's my poison. 
I can't bow out now. Got a plan. Hear it in your voice. Yeah. One I can't hope to enact without your help. Hansen pulled some tech out of a bunker under Dogtown. Tech that could cure both V and me. We need to clep it. Only way I see of doing that is to stay close. Play the prisoner. So, fuck. We'll wait for an opportunity and pounce. I'll be on the inside, ask for your help when the time's right. I can flee once I have that tech. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Ah, so me. Care to introduce your friends? It's not often I'm simply not familiar with guests attending my own party. And I never forget a face. Kurt Hansen. Name's V. Just V. Haven't seen so me in years. Trying to catch up. Oh, that's what this is. To me, reunions consist of picking up the broken, scattered shards of your heart. Or teeth. Always hurts. Well, I need to grab you, darling. I have a couple NC politicos here who are dying to meet you. And if we're to keep hungry rats from devouring Dogtown, we really do need to feed them the occasional scraps. I'm all yours, Kurt. See you soon, V. Oof. Cranium, it worked. Reestablished our link the moment I touched you. Interesting. I need a minute to process. And I need a drink. Heading downstairs. I'll explain everything. Just need you to listen. What's the deal, Zom? Doubt I've ever seen a prisoner parade around in a cocktail dress at a swanky party. Not to mention being hella friendly with their captor. It's a charade, V. Doing what I need to survive, to get what I want. I'm letting Hansen show me off like his personal trophy. V, I... I can't explain everything now. It's... too much. But I really do need your help. All I want is to get that cure for us. It's what I've been chasing all along. Not liking this. Not a bit. I don't like my situation either. It's very shit for all three of us. There, I said it. The cure. How do we get it? We need the Neural Matrix. Secret tech that incorporates AIs from beyond the Black Wall. The Matrix is nested in a mainframe Hansen pulled out of the bunker. The mainframe secured, but Hansen lacks the key. That's the problem. Neural Matrix? What is it, exactly? In short, it's storage. A carrier for an AI trapped within certain boundary conditions. When the AI is triggered, it'll execute what's stipulated within those conditions. But I really can't go into detail now. We don't have the time. Got a plan? Spill it. Hansen needs me and a duo of runners who worked on this tech in the past. They actually grab access codes they're willing to unload for a price. Classic black market shit. They're bringing access, I'm bringing know-how about how to pull the matrix and data off the mainframe. We're to work side by side, giving us a chance. You clip the access codes, then get the runners out of the way. You'll then impersonate them for a meet with Hansen. Same meet where we'll swipe the matrix out from under his nose. So, runners, we're to impersonate them? How? Personality theft tech. Firm kind of specializes in it. Alex and Reed know it well, they'll explain. Of all people, couldn't have imagined those two would be on our side, helping. This job, this whole story about Hansen, 
Not adding up something fierce, Song. You're hiding something, still. I don't have time to explain the ins and outs now. V, please, we need the Matrix. Focus on the runners, find them. They're here, downstairs. Red-headed twins, walled to the teeth with ice. Grocery scans will show you bunk. You're blowing me off. Champagne glass over there. Prep some intel for you. Get it to read. You'll need it later. Really need to go now, V. I'm counting on you. Songbird. And she's gone.
seems your special agent has special needs. Trying to drown his sins and sorrows. Talk to Songbird via the Relic. We can communicate again. Hmm. All good there, Reed? Yeah. I just need to process for a minute. It's just how I'm built. A little adversity and I need a few moments to think. Come up with anything? Yeah. We now know who took a swipe of Myers's head. What are you thinking? Don't know about you, but I see coincidences as patterns. Structures we have yet to recognize. Huh. What you driving at? SF-1 crashes. Not anywhere, but over specific turf. Controlled by someone who found some obscure forgotten tech in a secret bunker. Right. Crash was an inside job. We suspected that from the get-go. Now we know it was. And we know it was Songbird. She was behind it. Too early for conclusions, don't you think? Got no proof she planned this in advance. Could have improvised. Reacted to facts. Come on. You don't actually think she learned about the cure just now? She made a deal with Hanson earlier. Had to. Before any of this went down. Traded the President's life for access to the tech. The NUS press sold to a crime lord. Huge. If true. Myers pressured Somi to reach further, breach boundaries. And then Somi snapped. <sighs> Don't know about that. Song recruited me specifically to pull Myers out of that wreck. I seriously doubt she wanted her dead or snatched by Hanson. It's never that simple, V. As I see it, Somi was playing both sides, simultaneously spinning deals with Hansen and you. She has Hansen set, then you come in. She contacts you via the relic, asks you to rescue the president. Absolution for her right there. You need to cure just as much, guaranteeing you'll help if her plan falls through. And here we are. Yeah, and here we are, rushing to Songbird's rescue. Thinking a few steps ahead was always a strength. But judgment calls and situational assessment, her Achilles heel. As a chess master, she'd be famous for dazzling plays and excruciatingly beautiful defeats. Sheesh, don't know what to believe just yet. That's not surprising. But I know Somi well enough to know she'll do her damnedest to be fair. So, what are you thinking about all this? I'm not convinced Somi's to blame for everything. In this trade, nothing's ever as it seems. You gotta keep asking questions till you get to the bottom of it. That's experience talking. Main thing now is to get her out of this cesspool of a sitch. Then we'll see which direction to take. Right. Still should watch her every move closely. Sure. Unconditional trust? No more. Out the window. Right. Back to the sitch at hand. What do we have to do to save her? To grab the tech Songbird and I both need, we gotta go to a meet with Hansen. Prep for it's required. Cause we show up as a pair of runners. Need to collect their identities first. Whatever that means. Personality imprint theft. Sounds like our Colombian job of yore. Who are they and where do we find them? So how's one go about it? Clubbing someone's personality? FIA Menanthropic Tech. Alex has access. You should have used it already. You look, sound, and act like the individual whose personality you assume. To do it, we need scans of our targets. Song got this shard to me. Take a look. Our targets are a brother and sister, red-haired twins. They're here somewhere, schmoozing. 
Hmm. Okay, we need to pull data, get samples of assorted behavior. We make contact with them, talk, scan as we talk. Got it, I think. So, time to make our move? Over there. Wow. Traced them to Flash, Reed. Noticed them some time ago. They stand out even in this mountain pot. Twin roulette, looks like. Alex, you copy that? Radio loud and clear. Prep and scan tech now. You're new to this, but relax. We'll do it as a four-hander. I scan one, you handle the other. Alex will pilot us through. V, zipping funds your way from our operating budget. Load up on chips and join their game. Just don't go all in from the get-go. We stagger our approach, and we're strangers. Let's get to this. Struck gold with roulette, really. Gambling throws people around, high and low, brings the joy of winning and the despair of defeat. Perfect for our purposes. Greetings, madam. Wanna buy some chips? Of course. Good luck at the tables. V, important. You're not there to have fun. Simple bets, red or black only. None of the double street or basket bullshit. Understood? Understood. Eleven. Will you join us? us? Black. Place your bets, please. Bettings open? By all means. Make it red. Relax. Buy him drinks. Break the ice. I'll join you momentarily. All bets are in. Betting is closed. What? No introduction? V. You? Aurore Cassel. And that boar is my brother, Emmerich. How's things? Any luck? We started just moments ago. What's your poison? My treat? A bourbon for me. Alas, mon frère does not drink. You heard the lady. And real water for the gentleman here. And what'll you have? Same as the lady. Bourbon coming up. Your drinks will be here shortly. 31. Odd. Black. Et merde! Place your bets, please. <sighs> Last chance. Let's go, let's go. Red. B. Can't get a hold of Reed. No idea where he is. Stall for time, okay? Hmm, I just realized. Uh, you must have dirt beneath your fingernails too, like all these bastards and bitches. That is, unless you're uh, in tourist, like the no-lifers who must watch others live to feel anything. Provocative. Conscience ain't sparkling clean. No. Mmm, I like those who brag about such things. 35. Odd. Black. A defeat. Ah! Is she fucking done here? Duh! <sighs> Place your bets, please. Can't help feeling I, uh, interrupted something when I walked up. Do not worry yourself about this. Oh, come, come. V is just being cordial. N'est-ce pas, V? You weren't snooping just now, 13. were you? Odd. Black. Still no sign from Reed, V. 
got a sinking feeling about this. Place your bets, please. Eight's my magic number, so gonna go with eight. Sure wasn't snooping. No, just being plain courteous. Oh, don't be such a bore. I simply don't like bores. Of course you were snooping, as we are simply too interesting to ignore. Listen, Reed's MIA for now. Can't wait for him. Gotta do both scans on your own. We were discussing local politics, specifically our host, Monsieur Kurt Hansen. Big fish selling big guns for big money. Yet here you have celebrities, politicians, even the chief of police. So I was thinking, uh, perhaps Hansen would do better by being a veritable businessman, no? I claim he would. Mon cher frère disagrees. 21. Odd. Red. Ugh. Guess it's not my lucky day. Place your bets, please. Who is Kurt Hansen really? A crucial question. Tread carefully with that duo, V. What do you think? Will you tell? The fuck? Psychoanalysis a hobby of yours? No, putain. I'm merely trying to have a conversation. Big no. It's too hard. I'm asking what you think of him, not if his parents loved him. Don't know the guy that well, really. Honest. I like it. Better this than invented nonsense. Nice little dodge, V. 36. Even. Red. Place your bets, please. You wouldn't be in train to become too pot with her. Don't be jealous, frère. It's not like we had to kiss her and me. Charming little show you're putting on. You see, Emmerich, we are charming. I mean, Hansen could take Dog down by the throat, eject the junkies, and make it a paradise for billionaires. Just getting rich is dull. You should work for the community, invest, create jobs, throw banquettes. She's getting chatty. Doing good, V. And charities are excellent washing machines. You launder billions, believe me. Five, odd, red. Place your bets, please. And you're so childish, it's beautiful. What? Hansen going missionary position in business? Nonsense. <sighs> Reed's still not responding. But you keep working it. Let's go. Swap twins. And basically owns Dogtown. Could use that as leverage. And who would Hansen be? The mayor? Please. He is very good at what he does. A professional criminal. Soldier yesterday, crime lord today. Why not biz shark tomorrow? Yet he is a businessman. And to make it legal? It is a lot of work to do for a simple change of label. Good. Little worms opening up. Seventeen. Odd. Black. Place your bets, please. Care to expand? Floor's yours. Allow me to save ye. Arms or property, it would make no difference to me what I sell. And to spend five years on efforts to uh, change how people see you, call you. To be upstanding in the eyes of others, I could not give a shit. 18. Even. Red. Ah, damn. I should have bet on red. Place your bets, please. Getting there. Almost got it. 
Give me something big now. Make them laugh or cry, I don't care. Please place your bets. Like the tingle of risk? Oh, ma vieille, t'as pas d'idée. Thinking we can add a little spice to our game. I'm listening. My, my, I too, I'm curious. How about we go all in? Bet everything we won tonight. <gasps> and we play different colors, yes? You win or we do. And either you or we lose all. My thoughts exactly. A moment. You join the table, buy drinks, talk and talk. Now you wish to risk everything? I find this disquieting. Perhaps you could now tell us about yourself. Tread lightly. Name's V. Afterlife affiliated. Make what you will of it. Oh, are you happy now? You choose first, then. I'm seeing red coming. Black for us, then. Some you lose some, folks. Leave us for a moment, if you please. A goodbye, then. I know your friend Reed is FIA. My natural assumption is you're an agent, too. I'm also guessing you two took it upon yourselves to save the president. Then exfil her out of Dogtown. I should send you back to Night City in body bags, filled with pieces. You trying to scare me? Dunno. Are you afraid? We're just talking, aren't we? You're not about to kill us. Got it right? To be honest, I got tired of the media circus. All the allegations thrown in my face. The bullshit propaganda. Luckily, we can put all that behind us now. Oh, so what now? Gonna kidnap me? Torture me? I will let you and Reed walk free of this place, in one piece, on your own two feet. Consider it a gesture of my goodwill. Your little bird came to me on her own, though. She was tired of breaking international laws on the president's whim. She simply had to run away. Breaching the black wall? Jeopardizing the net, all humankind's safety in fact, for personal gain? I wonder what Netwatch would say. Pass it on to President Myers. Also tell her, her toy of mass destruction is my friend now. And she should get the fuck out of my backyard, or the world will learn about her games. I've matters to attend to. You'll find Mr. Reed downstairs. Okay, V. Got all we need. Sheesh. Colossal prick. Hear what he said? Yeah, caught it all. Didn't like it one bit, either. That I'd find Reed downstairs. Yeah, heard him. Wasn't crazy about his tone. Time to evac V. Best not tempt the fates. Head to the elevator, ride down to one. Need to know what's up with Saul.
going to eat something, Lizzie. No buts. Is something happening? Hmm. People are checking. Thinking about what that prick said. Songbirds are walking, talking WMD. And Hansen's got her on a tight leash. And he can prime her for use whenever he wants. Listen, V, we need to get her out. For everyone's sake. Guy knows. Got some dirt on Myers. Can't imagine it happening. But if the public learns that any U.S. president willingly broke international laws governing cyberspace use... Then USA's fucked. Myers will either have to take the fall, let herself be buried in dirt for this... Or she'll defy the world and spark another war. Fuck me! Oh, just once I'd like to see things go smoothly, as planned. This feels so very, very wrong. You and your troom best be headed the fuck out now. Straight on from here. Gonna walk you two out. Come on, V. No reason to hang. I'm going. I'm going. Sheesh. That's right, you are. And no funny biz while you're at it. Hey, hold the fuck up. Are you the ones who busted your way in? Through them tunnels like... eels or something. Got nothing to say, bitch? Uh, got us confused with someone else, man. Yeah. Yeah, it's you. He took out some of my tunes. We fucking serve together. Maybe Hansen let you walk. But we won't. And since he is not here, who knows what's gonna happen. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. I know how you feel. Do you? Get the fuck out of my face. That's what I thought. Or you can stick around. Get down on all fours, twerk it, and work it. Nora, wasn't that we'll hard? Moments. Done showing off? Great. Hit the fucking road. Step back immediately! It's your lucky day, you two-faced shits. Fuck out of here! How things go, V? Got everything. All set. You got thorough scans of the runners. Both of them. Yourself. I said, we got everything. Well, well. And then you, uh, excused yourself. Stepped away. Disappeared? How about you spill where you been? What happened? Had us worried. The op was underway. I didn't want to jeopardize it, so... When confronted, I behaved. They cornered me, got me before we could meet up. Forget the rest. How to go at the table? Anything to worry about? 
Hansen showed up. We chatted. Threats were made, actually. Said if Myers doesn't let up, world will learn about Songbird, about Pierce and the Blackwall. He clearly knows what Somi means to the president. Personal WMD, you mean? Yeah, Hansen knows all. Need to get her the fuck out, Reed. Really? I was afraid of this. Okay. P, Alex and I have work. We need to analyze the data from Soundbird. Might take a day or two. Prem, open comms line then? Sure. We'll work out a game plan. Get back to you ASAP. Oh, and V, bang up work. someone like you end up here my owner bought me from some junk dealers revamped reprogrammed and finally infused me with her spirit gape earth and this unhappy wretch in tomb or change my form whence all my sorrows come the tree still planted in the unfinished part not wholly vegetative and heaved her heart uh, your programming sounds ancient what can I get you? Jillian Jordan, and this is the latest from around the world. The lunar ring sky I really Think so. The classic copy and paste of Ah V, you're here. It's about time too. We're nearly done finalizing the plan. Op not sitting well with you, Alex. Reminds me of a few other stitches we handled. One in particular sticks out. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. What happened in Medellin? What was the up there? We had our size trained on a guy who sat on the Colombian president's back pocket. Sold him smuggled corp tech. You saying the FIA pulls strings overseas? A lot of what we do doesn't get printed in the norm sheets. Anyway, we used stolen identities on that mission too. Things didn't go exactly as planned, but that's a long story. Think we can spare 60 seconds? Hell, might even learn something about So Me that'll prove useful. All right. 
Our person of interest was one Luis Hernandez, arms trading heavyweight. We aim to plant our own SA in his organization. Alex had adopted the identity of an engineer from Hernandez's entourage. She was our ticket in. She walks in to attend a meeting one day. She sees one of Luis's bikini model girlfriends prancing out on her way to walk his dopamine. Spending big money on kids' luxury it was kind of his M.O. So what happened? Well, Somi had put together Hernandez's dossier. Problem was, an important detail slipped through the cracks. The engineer's abject fear of dogs. Cold sweat, shaky hands, soggy pant leg, that kind of fear. When the Doberman sniffed Alex's knee, she pats him on the head and says, who's a good boy? Then she went to pull up a chair at Hernandez's table. Before she could sit down, they had two barrels to her head and one trained at the base of her spine. What did you do? Well, my hands are bound, got a sack on my head, hear a collapsible baton snap into place, flack. I did what anyone do in that sitch. I lied my fucking ass off. Don't sit quite straight to this day, though. Okay, back to Night City, folks. With our sights trained on a new target. We've parsed the intel from the shard Somi gave us. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want to run. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here's your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. No, she was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Stop worrying, Reed. We'll get her out. Save her. I know. And not just her. Ladder goes for you, too. Right. Our objective. To free Somi from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue route. Because... Well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall. A consequence of her service to the NUS and President Myers. I'm not about to pretend I understand the tech wise and how. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, gonna kill her. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. So this neural matrix, how much do we know? Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint U.S. Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter our Asaka soul killer. The matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the black wall, and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you in Songbird. All right. Plan. Let me hear it. Hanson to meet with the Netrunners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close to Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know its security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hansen access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hansen's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural Matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now we just need to take those twins out of the equation. Hey, Marik and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand. Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. 
I buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, because they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hanson. So we kidnap them. How we want to do this? They're driving a rental while in NT. An exploitable opening. We're gonna track their ride and hijack it. Before they reach Hanson at the stadium. That's where you come in, Pete. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Addicts will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavior imprints are tuned already. And your role in all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your exfil wrap. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem-free. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hanson? Right. Where well, you'll sell him the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hanson's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hanson. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Gonna disarm Hanson, take him and his guards out. Hanson and his goons. Aim to handle them on your own? Can do a lot more than play dress-up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. Sounds like Flatline and Hanson set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the anywhere. And Songbird. We have to rescue her. Myers told you as much yourself. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. How much have you told Myers? What's she know? That Somi's fallen into the hands of the man who's organized the downing of Space Force One. Is that all? All for now. Main goal, want to make sure I'm clear. Just bringing Songbird free from Hanson's iron grip. And seasoned tech that's gonna save your lives. You and Alex enter the stadium as Hanson's visiting Netrunners. Disguises our key to the op. First step, what was it again? Securing a trace on the Netrunner's car. This bit's on you. Alex will expand on that in a minute. Meanwhile, we'll make sure the personality data and imprints are airtight. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. So, time we talked about nabbing the runners? Cover that in a minute. And any for your thoughts, Alex, about all this? Honestly, still wondering why neither of us went back to DC. Not me, not Reed. They put him to sleep. Saddled you with a Dogtown assignment. Who are you kidding? Say we disobeyed orders, gone back. A dressing down by some bureaucrat would be the worst we'd have had to endure. Think... Think we were both waiting for something, like the downing of Space Force One. Probably makes us a sad fucking pair of hypocrites. You know Reed better than I do. What he thinks. What's his true aim here? Saving so me or carrying out a mission? Saul imagines he's responsible for her. Always has. Thinks he's responsible for all of us. Hell, even for you, I bet. It's how he keeps his grip on reality. Life. With mixed results, mind you. <laughs> and so me? Same story as always. Dares, lands neck deep in shit, somehow crawls out. Rinse and repeat. Myers doesn't know the deeds of this op, does she? Never will. Is that right? 
It's not wrong. So, we serve Hansen up on a silver platter. It'll be salutes and handshakes. Shit goes sideways. We're royally fucked. Welcome to the agency. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far, near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. Stations. How do they work exactly? They ping vehicle IDs across the network. Monitor location, tire pressure, all of that. Hack them, and it'll be open season on the runners. Find it hard to believe taking one station will be enough. Rental agency's got rare rides to protect. Hmm. See if I can find more info. If the one's not enough, we'll improvise. So breach the station, trace the car. Good, what then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Dunno. Anything goes wrong, I'll be stuck in there. Suck it up. This is FIA Trunk Ops, soldier. <laughs> Seriously, though, the tech just works. And we'll have your back the whole way. Sounds simple enough. Tech worth tens of thousands can help any plan go off like a dream. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it. talk long, but two things, quickly. First, good news. I managed to upgrade your Relic's firmware. You'll see what I mean in a minute. Don't worry. Pick? Completely painless. upgraded. How'd you manage it? No easy feat, I'd guess, tweaking tech that advanced. Mm, let's say I've had extra time on my hands. More than I expected. Don't worry. We're getting you out of there. I know. First good news, you said. So there a second thing? Right. It's super important. It stays between us. It's gotta. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk freely. Okay, need to Delta. We'll see you soon. I mean, look at this gate. Steel beam, barbed wire, armed guards.
all running away. Fast as you can. Mom, don't talk like that. Great. Just great. I ain't got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Think we're good with just one more? <laughs> it's a car rental company, for Christ's sake. How sophisticated a system can they have? Let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed as soon as you grab that encryption key. See my age. Looking for something? Won't find it here. Nothing to find. Hey, is that your mom? Is she doing all right? Uh-huh. She's fine. You sure about that? Dunno, maybe you ought to tell someone- Nah, she just came down from two days of BD and she'll wake up soon, snarf a scop dog and cry about having a headache. She always does that. Transceiver. Need to jack in quick. Two sucks and I'm gone. You do you. <sighs> Barked. It ain't working? <gasps> Jesus. You want a hint? 
I can tell you how to fix it if you really want to fix it. Old people need help with this stuff sometimes. So, yeah, turn it off first, then turn it back on. You know, I can tell you where to look for the on button for a thousand ads. Interested? Okay, Eddies are all yours. Nova, done deal. So, Switch, where is it? I don't know exactly, around here. Telling you where to look, not where to find it. Just like I said. We'll play hot and cold. If you're close or far, we'll holler hot or cold. Let's start playing. You'll get it. Like we said, ice cold! Colder! Gotta be what having a fucking stroke feels like. Perfect, Johnny. Thanks. Wasn't on purpose. Just gotta pick up the pace. Clock's ticking. I'm doing what I can.
Hey, you made it. Got a head start. A drink to calm the nerves. Appreciate the invite. Glad to see you, Alex. Sweet of you to say. I wrote you because... Because I needed someone to talk to. Someone outside the firm. And not some total rando. To take my mind off the mission. Not worry about being someone else for a millisec. Hope that makes sense. Didn't want to be alone with your nerves, huh? <laughs> Always used to tell myself. Cut the jitters, Alex. You don't get nervous. But for a while now, I've been trying to be more honest with myself. I just want to be a normal fucking person for a little bit. Myself, specifically. Just me. Just Alex. I like the sound of that myself. Just shed this skin and leave the Night City Merc behind. Hey, yeah. Like, who are you anyway? <laughs> good question. With all the shit going on in my life lately, a damn good question. And definitely too soon to know for sure. Say, you ever think about who you'd be now if, you know, life had taken a different turn? You know, the road might have been different, but I got this feeling I'd wind up in the same place all the same. Believe in destiny? Bad luck, more like. You can't know. Things could have been way worse. True. Hard to imagine, but no less true. To your health. Okay, now you. Who would you be, if not a secret agent and master of disguise? An actor. No hesitation there. Always dreamed of seeing my face on a show bill. I love musicals especially. Seriously? <laughs> Call me old fashioned. So yeah. Guess I'd be a brain dance star. Hmm. <laughs> Got any dream roles? Norma Desmond, Sunset Boulevard. Guessing that doesn't ring any bells. Not a single one. No surprise. It's ancient far as films go. I have a soft spot for tragic characters. Not to mention I see something of myself in her. Neither of us know when to let go. To our dreams. For they alone keep us sane. Ain't that the truth? I love this song. Never knowing which way's up down. It's never what it seems when it's all I'm ever missing. And it feels as though I'm waiting. And I don't need no head in my hands. No, I'm ever heading way south I think I'll find it all Somewhere between the ice and fire Cause it's 
Don't do this often, I'm guessing. Busted moves. I can't say I do. Who gave it away? <laughs> Wasn't thinking of dancing, but never mind. We'll see you on BD posters in no time. I know it. First, retirement. See you soon, V. Yesterday we completed some necessary repairs at the hospital. Two months of hard work have finally paid off. Starting today, the hospital and its staff will be operating under our protection. Sure we're alone? Wouldn't want any unpleasant surprises. No surprises. Except maybe you're already one of us. Don't trust a soul. This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. It means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off. I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills. Crack open beers. Talk about nothing in particular. I'd swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it. Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasted funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scop dogs around. He shit talking one of his tunes. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Yeah. Know the feeling. Got a place you hold close to your heart, too. Not a place. That was always changing. The people? Sure. 
memories of home. Yearning to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you miss something, it's usually too late. <sighs> Suppose we should get back to the here and now. Songbird, need you to be straight with me. I... I helped Hansen spring the trap on Myers. Maya did the deal in exchange for the neural matrix. I down the plane, deliver Myers, yes. But blast her out of the sky, then hunt her down? Wasn't what we agreed. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself, too, almost. Ground the plane. That was the plan. Didn't expect he'd blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix. And for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. fucked everything up. I know, V. But I had no choice. Still don't understand why. Wasn't any other way, honestly. Wouldn't have resorted to this if there was. For Myers, the NUSA, I'm just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. weapons and tools. They don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Sounds... Sounds painfully familiar. I think I know how you feel. I doubt anyone understands this feeling as well as you do, V. You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is... After everything you just heard, you feel the same way about me. Been one to ask, actually. What happens exactly, you know, when you reach past the black wall? Know the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life, but it just turns up blank. I mean, losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes I, I lose control. Or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else. But it feels horrible. Oh, did too. The chimera. Like a live-in nightmare. Yeah. More and more, I get the sense someone's standing behind me. But there's never anyone there. Don't trust Reed? Guy wants to save your life. Mm-hmm. He saved me once already. Word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk, so he knocked on a 19-year-old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse. Join and serve, or become a Netwatch trophy. That girl died that day. The person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed, he died too. Just more recently, seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence, yet he serves the country to this day, clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me.
Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah. With you and myself. I need to get away. From Kurt, then USA, Reed. From everything. Speaking of, out of everybody out there, you saw Hansen as a trusty ally. Seriously? I needed someone who could tear me from Wire's grip. I knew him from my time in Night City when I was posted here. Took a steep risk, all right. And a plain gonk one at that. That's why I enlisted you, too. Night City is just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved. Or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. How am I to know this isn't an elaborate con? Be nice to have some kind of guarantee. I can't give you one, sorry. But I've shown you my trust. I mean, you're free to sell me out to Reed, right? Or trust me enough to save us both. No guarantee for either of us. Fair deal, I say. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission. Grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then... You help me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... that's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? Can't be both. You'd fit right in in DC. Just enough truth, but not too much. I'll take what I can get. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hansen. Reed, hey. I'm Nova, thanks. How are you? Put a cold beer in front of me once this is all over. Then we'll have time to chat. For now, fill me in on what you managed to get done. So me contacted me. Got news. Let me hear it. Well, first off, we've been greenlit. Our VIP's ready to be served. Music to my ears. What else? Songbird opened up a bit. Better sitch. It's looking bad. Real bad. This tech's her only shot. I hear you. I do. All the more reason to focus on the mission in front of us. Get our hands on that cure. But Reed, what Somi spilled, we really need to talk. I know, but later. Not a topic for the hollow. V, one other thing. You need new chrome. An implant that accommodates behavioral imprints. I'm sending you deets for a clinic. A doc will be expecting you. Just tell the Ripper you know she collects unification war trinkets. 
She know you came with my blessing. You Farida? Yes, and we're closed. Got something might interest you? I doubt it. Here you collect trinkets. Unification war era. Mm hmm. Come in. I'm sorry I was unwelcoming. Ever since a certain space plane crashed nearby, I've had to be more cautious. V, good to see you. Huh. Here to see me? Things are in flux. The situation's changing faster. I thought we should talk. I'm here about Somi. I spent hours wrapping my head around this, putting myself in her shoes. I needed to understand what she must have been going through to... to resort to treason. You're in no position to understand, Reed. Your life ain't on a timer. But I know death. Stared him in the eyes up close. She's trapped. Not just here and now, but going months back. Hell. Actually years. I blame Myers, a sore loser. Does her damnedest to avoid it. Songbird, the Black Wall, dirty tricks meant to give her a competitive edge. It's no wonder Somi doesn't trust anyone, except maybe you, a little. Song should trust you, not me. That it? I can't say I really blame her. I can only blame myself. But could you have done anything differently? Something. Anything. Instead of giving in and being exiled in Night City, a couple thousand miles away. There's a prison cell prepped and waiting for her already. Somi knows that full well. She lives to see tomorrow and every day after. That's what matters. Myers needs her alive, sure, but forgive and forget the attempt on her life. Never. Myers might not forgive her, but doesn't mean I can't. What you trying to sell me, Reed? Nothing. I'm merely trying to convince you. Okay. We break the chain Hanson wrapped around her neck. Then what? 
We stow away somewhere safe. Ask some questions. Establish some common ground. Once I get the answers I'm looking for, I'll personally help it disappear. From everyone, everywhere. Including Myers. Wanna ask her a few questions, huh? To understand her sight. Got an idea already of what I'll hear. System broke her. Almost took her life. Like it did mine. As for me, well, my time's well past. But so is still worth saving. Spinning quite the yarn playing me. Fits the M.O. of someone who used to recruit spies for a living. Fuck! No! Just listen. I got contacts in Europe. We'll find the best clinic, put you two back together, fix what's broken. Once we have your cure in hand. But I need to help Soma first. She's lost, and I'm concerned she doesn't know what she's doing. You don't trust her? What I don't trust is the shit from beyond the black wall and the attendant paranoia. Both in play here, I'm afraid. She has another plan in mind. I'm damn sure of it. So me... She reached out. Wasn't telling the whole truth before. Wants out. Off the grid. Has it planned for right after we take down Hanson. Gonna make a run for it. Slip out of Night City. I... Thank you, V, for your candor. This means a lot to me. I have something for you. Our best minds in D.C. cooked it up. Icebreaker. Silver bullet against any fortified netrunner. Farida will feed it into your system during surgery. Use that, and Somi will drop unconscious within a minute. We can't take any chances, and when she wakes up, she'll wake up at home. She could sense the breaker. Not talking about some run-of-the-mill runner here. It's meta-heuristic, hyper-aggressive tech, cobbled together by a literal army of experts. If she does sense it, it won't matter. No one out there, alone, could withstand somebody like this. You sure this soft will work? Doubt it's been tested on anyone at Songbird's level. From what they tell me, this program can anticipate what she'll do before she even thinks to do it. By the time you cut one thread, it's already found another. A precision-guided weapon designed to evade countermeasures. Okay, how do I use it? Fire it up when you're both jacked into the mainframe. At that moment, Somi's door will be wide open. Two of you could just... You know, sit down, talk it out. That's my aim, precisely. After you kidnap her. Not quite the same. We've come to a point where some options are simply off the table. Right now, we're focusing on saving your lives. Talking time will come later. It's time I was on my way. I leave you in Farida's able hands. Call me once you're done here. The sooner we begin, the sooner we finish. Tush, meet chair. Okay. Anesthesia incoming. Don't worry, it's the good stuff. Relax and submit. An ID modding implant is complicated tech, true. But the procedure is surprisingly simple. Why run a clinic in Dogtown, of all places? The rents are low, and I siphon as much electricity as I need. 
Can't tell if you're being serious. Start your own biz in Night City proper. Then come see me in a month. We'll compare accounts. Okay. Anesthesia is taking hold. How many fingers am I holding up? <laughs> nice to see you in good form. Mm -hmm. You want something from me? To chat. Got no other options. You'll have to do. So tell me, what's it feel like to be a traitor? You know this is a lose-lose clusterfuck of a sitch. I ain't here by choice. At least you see that. Means they haven't turned you yet. Not completely. Come on, got iron in your hand. Gotta put it to someone's head. Pull the trigger. The master spy and the agent unloosed. Tragedy, comedy, or both. Think one of them's trying to dupe me? No, they're both telling the truth. I mean, might be muddy on the nitty gritty, but their motivations are plain and clear. Survival. It's her be all and end all. That, and she's a walking, talking nuke. The kind that keeps making mistakes, never knowing which one's gonna set her off. And Reed? Bastard and me are one and the same. If I hadn't ghosted the army, I'd have become a reed myself. Live and die by our principles. That's the tragedy, V. Someone's gonna play victim to the other's good intentions. Try not to forget that when you're standing over that fucking overgrown neuro drive. Reed? Or Songbird? What would you do in my shoes, Johnny? I am in your shoes, dumbass. For every gonk choice you make. But I can't do dick. But honest to God, V, not fucking around? I don't know. Got no goddamn clue. Well done. The facial morph implant is online. Now all you need is a behavioral imprint. And do me a favor. Don't tell me what you need this for. Thanks for everything. Uh-huh. Right. Hey, procedures are up. Hope you're not feeling too raw post for Eda's work. It's time to intercept and supplant the Netrunners. Just one hiccup. Our access to Cowan Exotics was cut. He must have discovered us. Wait, seriously? So we lost them? Not entirely. We know they were last in the city center. Get it out, Chris. Find a vantage point near the entrance of Dogtown. You'll grab a trace on the runners as they drive to the meeting.
No sign of their ride. See a convoy. Hanson's goons. Doubt the runners would have a security escort, though. I'll keep watching. Additional support for the stadium, most likely. Clean so far. No visual on our targets. No visual on our targets. Got a totaled Cortez blocking the road. Traffic's piling up. First basic, run of the mill. Definitely not them. And we keep looking. Couple of bikers. Don't expect they'd swap out four wheels for two last minute. Yeah, not this style. On to the next. There they are. No question. Both runners are inside. Got the signal? Not gonna slip off our radar anymore. Good work. Still early for the meet with Hanson. They'll stop. Kill time somewhere. Okay, they're stationary. And out of the car. Walking towards the club now. V, you're clear to head for the car. Get to it. Stupid! Don't fucking ride me, pal!
Are you in position? Here we are. Damn. Dream ride. Hey, you're not there to window shop. Smooth sailing so far. Car's cam feeds are mine. Good. Last check now. Make sure you're ready to roll. Should be good. Just give me one sec. Why? What are you doing? Tweaking the ice. Kind of half-baked way it's set up now. Fine. Just no unnecessary risks. And done. Not bad. Now we wait. Our VIPs are back. They're about to get in. Time to focus up. Kurt Hansen, tu l'as vu, non? Il était grave en train de me relooker au saphir. À moins que ce soit cette putain de gueule de bois. Oh, ça tourne partout, dans tous les sens. T'en penses quoi De Hansen, je veux dire. Ok, V, take control. Hold on. He's dropping a bit. Could get interesting. Oh, il a foutu le feu au cul de tout le monde quand il a abattu cet avion. Le risque est élevé, oui. Mais ce travail paie bien. On fait notre part. Ensuite, on disparaît. Oh, putain de gueule de bois de sa mère Il a fallu que tu fasses ça aujourd'hui. Je t'avais dit de pas ouvrir cette dernière bouteille. Oui, hey, you copy. La voiture Quelqu'un en a pris le contrôle Fabrix, sonne l'alarme On a besoin d'aide Je vais localiser le vecteur Ok, seconde c'est fait Putain, allez J'essaie de reprendre le contrôle They're playing defense. And they're good. their hands with duct tape, shove socks in their mouths and wait for them to wriggle free and call for help? This ain't no game, V. It's a simple choice. Them or us. I chose us. Alex, you knew about this! This execution! Of course I knew. Textbook move. Not exactly my first mission, V. 
Call like that comes with the territory. It is a game. Your fucking spy game they weren't playing. They were innocent. That's not quite how I'd describe two pro criminals. These innocents, as you call them, wouldn't hesitate to rob you for everything you got, or put a bullet in your back. Alright, we have fresh disguises already, but you still need to lift the access codes off them. Aurora's the one to check for those. Sure she's the one with the codes? Definitely. Her brother transfers his memories to external data banks, and he's had these stolen before. They wouldn't risk losing these codes. Right, codes transferred. Taking the wheel. The behavior imprint now. Check, check. Oh shit, my voice! <laughs> nice! Hang on, that's me? What the hell? Cream, right? Give it a whirl. Introduce yourself. Huh. A little miracle must do more than morph your face and voice. Gotta fuck with your hormones like a designer drug. Give you hyper-specific highs and lows to change your behavior. Mm hmm it Establishes a new baseline. You just gotta say the right words. Okay, here goes. Aurore Cassel. Who the fuck is asking? Hmm, not bad. It can feel like a real trip at first. But you'll get used to it. And take a sec. Collect yourself, then we move. Hansen's waiting. Alex, it just hit me. This will be our last stop together. I haven't forgotten our deal. My eyes green it. A diplomatic mission. No end date. Call it early retirement. Thanks much, Reed. Are you ready to fuck shit up? Good. Sound just like her. Any pre-op jitters? Kinda. I guess. But? Here in a butt in there. It's just... More than anything... I miss this. Okay, let's get to it. Alright, stadium then. See you there. Before we arrive, remember, 
Name's Aurore Cassel. Let me let you in on my secret about how to be someone else. Ask yourself three questions. What do they fear? What do they want? What's their deepest secret? Got that? Don't answer now, just something to keep in mind. And be her. So, Aurore, your thoughts on Hansen? Tell me. Hololo, the bastard is king of his realm. He is too big, too strong to be removed. Not by the powers in Night City, not by the NUS. The locals think, ah, fuck it, he's okay. And the NUSA? Impotent. It cannot challenge Night City over one man and broken buildings. Man, couldn't agree more. Plus, I like his massive balls. <laughs> not a metaphor. The actual coconuts in his pants. Uncanny and disturbing. Spot on horror. Good work. Arrived, the hound's den. In possession, ready for the next phase. Talk soon. something from us, not the other way around. We're here to sell him Sinoshore mainframe access codes. Stick to the facts. Know who you are and are not. We are here. Don't lose your goats, Emmerich. Meeting with Colonel Hansen. Checking now, need a sec. Don't scare Good, you made it. We haven't met yet. Name's Murphy. Oh, let's finish this quickly. My hangover is killing me. This way. So, Songbird told me a little about you. Said you two hail from Europe. That's right. And... Did you enjoy yourselves at the Sapphire? Police commissioner, a candidate for mayor, the Tiger Claws bookkeeper. All gambling on the city's future together. Figuratively, and not. The anatomy of corruption is beautiful here. Uh, 
Uh, yeah. Took the words right out of my mouth. Okay, here's our stop. You should expect to have eyes on you all day today. Kurt got a tip. The FIA plans to pull some gonk move. Situation's under control. He ordered everyone checked out, though. No exceptions. Many wish your colonel dead. He must be vigilant. Got our people manning the whole stadium. Drone-aided scans providing surveillance support, too. Need you to leave your weapons here. Next, we'll need to run some ID scans. Joke around as we might, get along as we do. Ultimately, this is a place of serious business. You understand? This here is the heart of our little empire. Ah, how you sell these war machines? It's like a car salesman? Kinda, <laughs> yeah. But wholesale only. Suppose you're a dictator from some rinky-dink country. I don't know. Australia, let's say. Tanks, choppers, subs. You want it, we got it. No red tape. You have submarines! Fresh out. But we sure did. Now, here's something that ought to be... All right, I'm in position. Prepare an ID back route now. Take your time. I need ten more minutes at least. Not much further now. I couldn't get started earlier without risk of being compromised. And the roar? It should go without saying. But stay in character. Good luck. This way. Have you been with Anson since the beginning? Since the op in Night City, you mean? You could say that, but we served together earlier, too. I see. Then he must trust you very much. Pleasure to see you both. Songbird needs a moment to disarm the device. Which gives us a chance to chat. Please, there is no need to hurry. We have a terrible hangover. <laughs> Both of you? A bit of rhetoric. Emmerich doesn't drink, but when I do, both of us suffer. Well, we'll fix that right quick. Do you often conduct business hungover? <laughs> a nanny for your thoughts? My first time. I give you my word. I'm sure it is. I know you don't believe me. But I do. Truly? <laughs> Yet even I do not believe me. As you can see, Colonel Anson, we sometimes lack a soldier's discipline. But with unique flaws come unique strengths. I have no doubt. I'd like to raise a little toast. To a successful day of business. <laughs> Don't worry about the work, Colonel. Just your health. I must decline. It's changing the subject. Did you enjoy yourselves at the Sapphire? 
My people tell me the stakes went high. You two left richer and happier, I hope. I thought it a night at the casino, wine and cash until both ran out. But then this new piece of ass joined our table. Another one. Thanks to them, winner winner chicken dinner. The Black Sapphire. My pride and joy. I worked hard to make it the go-to destination for Night City's royalty. Oh, actually, before I forget, I learned recently that we have a mutual friend. She said you did time together at La Sante. Remembers you well. No, no, this is not something I wish to revisit. Not with someone I hardly know. But she very much insisted. Old thieves code and all that. Raquel. Asked me to say hello. She did her time under max security, C-block. Said her rat tattoo might jog your memory. <laughs> this Raquel is clearly mistaken. Max security is separate from the VIP wing where I stayed. <laughs> Thank God. Ah, it must have been someone like you. Very much like you. Indeed. How many years have you been in Night City? They say you served with Militech once. Seven years now. And yes, before that it was my mission to plant an NUS flag on this soil. Then it appears to be a great success. The things you have achieved here. Impressive. That flag's a piss-soaked pile of ash now. What I built, I built with my own two hands, for me. Why did you change sides? Because I don't need a convenient ideology to hide my business behind. I tossed the flag, but the suits in DC still remember me. President Myers, too? She called just six months ago, in fact. Asked me to help with a mess she couldn't clean up herself. Bureaucracy, red tape, and all that. Interesting. And, uh, she calls, still? Not lately. Her administration recently encountered some, uh, turbulence along its path. Ah, by the way, at the Sapphire, you asked me to contact a certain fashion type. Uh, remind me who? Oh, the tailor of Kerry Eurodyne. Oh, he is so flavorful. Mm, I must have a taste. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, that's the one. The fashion world isn't exactly my forte, so I'll need maybe a week to arrange it. Your sister certainly is the more talkative of you two. You noticed? You compliment each other well. Listen, it seems we've got time to spare. There's another opportunity I'd like to discuss. An expansion into Western Europe. What I need is a reliable partner on the ground. Two would be even better. Is something wrong? Hey. Relax, soldier. You know, Kurt, the arms trade. <laughs> we keep our fingers out of this cookie jar. I see. But all I need is a nudge in the right direction. Some introductions, a little intelligence, one-time request. Say, 200,000? Mmm, now I have butterflies. I need an inn with Les Collectifs. I'm sorry, Colonel, but you are teasing the wrong cock. Am I? But you're famous in Paris. You must have a connection. Le Collectif and we um, have a history. Like you and your NUSA. We do not uh, make love. No fucking love at all. <laughs> I see. And appreciate both the honesty and the metaphor. Ah, so me. We can begin. 
The mainframe is ready. You remember the terms. One of you feeds in the access codes, the other stays with me. I will stay. Shall we? Follow me. So tell me, how do you like NC now that you're back? This hollow shell? While you are waiting, I ran some initial diagnostics. The mainframe is prepped and linked with our systems. She's ready to go. You know, he created this lab especially for the occasion. Tens of millions of eddies invested for your visit alone. That's Kurt for you. I have a plan in place for when we secure the neural matrix. I'll hack the local net, override its defense systems, turn the whole stadium hostile. We'll slip out in the chaos. But... how many would die? Stand clear, please. You're They'll blocking die me. so we can survive. Live. I managed to simulate the mainframe's native environment. The bunker. It'll be ready for the access codes in a moment. Listen, B. All hell breaks loose in two minutes. When Hanson flatlines, we haul ass. I'll block access to this room. Alex and Reed are minimizing risk and exfilling early via the route. Here she is. In all her glory. Oh, and don't worry about us. Got that sorted already. Check stadium blueprints. No way to run. So, shall we? No turning back now. No. Nope. But we're in this together. Ready. Linked. Is the connection clear? Thousandth of the decimal. It'll have to do. Time to get wet. Actuating the mainframe. Hansen suspects something. Just hasn't caught on yet. Soon it won't matter. Mm, I see. It's responding. Stay sharp. Almost open for input. Hey, thank you. Really. Thank you for being here. Just... a little... more... Okay, your turn. It's ready for the access codes. Link in now. I'm with you, Somi. Look toward Alex. Wait for her to go down. Everything all right? You look like shit. Nice to hear. Running three things at once here. You do one. Keep your eyes on Kurt. Can do. What then? We run. Nearly have the Matrix. Breaching stadium defenses now. It's... a lot. Had to reach past the Black Wall. You mean to say, like, the whole stadium? Cutting off the lab now. Carving a path out of here for us. Defense systems are nearly primed to turn on Kurt's forces. Let Alex know. Mm-hmm. Target down. It's done. Stadium defenses. Hostile and online. Alright. 
Somi, you okay? What's wrong? The Matrix, the, the stadium, the black wall. Just lost control for a sec. But, yeah, I'm okay now. What? V, you need to bolt. Stuff around you. Just can't push myself. The mainframe breach. Black hole hit me hard. You can spin the chopper's rotor. Murphy, we need to get to a higher level. I can do something to distract him. Can you commandeer the Panzer turret? Good distraction.
the door. We have a moment to catch our breath. Uh. Which? Yeah, give me a sec. Heck, in the mainframe took a lot out of you. The mainframe? The stadium? Bit off more than I could chew. Pull up ahead. Equipment's fine. Other half's lit up like a fucking Christmas tree. Oh, we're gonna be down what? At least a couple of days? Ugh, fuck, dude. Try a week? Shit. We need to close down the stadium. Too risky without working systems. It's them! Hurt us! We won't say a word! Promise! Drones. 
exiting from the back of the stadium. I've arranged two cars. En route already. One's for you, the other's for me. Should make us harder to track. Budging. Oh, I will. Oh, what's this? Finally. Okay. Jump in. Think I see uh, them. Got alarms for. Uh, blast. Gotta be them. Fuck. Fucking ankle. Hanson's dogs could swoop in any sack. Be gonna need a hand. Come on, Zomi. Final stretch. Toward the gate. Carl be there. Thank you, V. Yo, is it true what they say? That you're a deserter? If I gotta be so trouble for us, I need to get it straight. No, it ain't. I'm sorry. How are you so sure? It's we ain't seen nothing. Yeah. There they are. All right. Any it's here for them. That's a dumbass bit. That mean you'll take it? So me, we we did it. Got away from Hanson and the FIA. Not quite, V. This was the first step. I won't rest easy until I'm out of NC airspace. Seriously? Gonna hop on another plane after how you wound up here? You'll see. Sure you're gonna make it out of this? If I don't, you'll hear about it on the news. Hope you got a plan for what comes next. We need to split up. Try to throw off the agency's pursuit strategy. Meanwhile, I'll confirm my path out of Night City is clear. Once I do, I'll be in touch. Where are we gonna meet? And when? I'll send you the coordinates. Just wait for my sake. And don't get caught. Hey, likewise. And V? Thanks. Don't sound so hot. Sure you're all right? Mm, quite. This is what it is. Okay. Should I be worried? Won't help if you do. Just do your part. Grab us a ride. I'm parked. I'm sending you the courts. Join you soon. Here I come. And don't drag your feet. You won't be disappointed. My, my, here we go today.
town without the Colonel. Can't hardly imagine it. Oh, please, brother. He a common thug. Not even that. Not no more. Worm food's worm Tone food. Tone it down, Chumba. Ah, at last. I lacked the time to brew tea. My apologies. Face to face again? What's changed? Everything. And that's what we'll discuss. Kurt Hansen. A man of many hats. A criminal. Dog of war. To mine eye, an entrepreneur. And business suffocates in a vacuum. Vultures circle the Colonel's corpse already. The enterprise he built must choose a new leader. We will make certain they choose correctly. The Shard, please insert it. Let me guess. Got a successor all lined up, don't you? Lieutenant Colonel Bennett, one of Hansen's most loyal, commands respect, is capable of rallying a strong base. The logical choice, this gentleman soldier. Alas, he has competition. A man named Yago. He's starting from a lower rung, but has high aspirations. He's already begun seeking outside support from the Voodoo Boys. You will meet with Yago. You will convince him to back down. What's Bennett's story? Ex-Marine took part in Operation Midnight Storm. He never questioned orders, didn't serve for glory or medals. Loyal from start to finish. Tick tock. Not up to Time snuff? waits for no Why? man. He's an accountant, no soldier. Kept Hansen's books for him. V, you don't win hearts by counting numbers. Okay, I'll handle that. No, you won't. But Aguilar will. Uh, you lost me. Hansen remained on top because he had the contacts to stay afloat. Most important among them was a Cuban cartel. Enter Aguilar, a merc assassin from Havana, a living legend. Every time someone in Havana lights a cigar, Aguilar extinguishes a life somewhere around the globe. I'm lucky to have her behavioral imprint on hand. You're lucky to have experience with the tech already. Merc assassin, huh? Color me curious. Anything else I ought to know? Real name, unknown. Body count, unknown. Conservative estimates put it in the dozens. Per continent. Rumors, perhaps. But rumors often make for crowning arguments in negotiation. Let me summarize. Need me to assume Aguilar's identity? Have a chat with Yago. Talk him out of any silly ideas he might have. Child's play. Okay. All's crystal. I prepared a shard with helpful intelligence. Also a weapon. The same Aguilar uses. Help yourself to both. Interesting piece of iron. Custom made. A unique and highly persuasive tool. Mm -hmm. Time to kick the tires, V. Suit up and take the imprint for a whirl.
feel the difference. My time's precious, Hans. If this don't work, you'll need to find ten new digits or aim for a rebrand. Hmm. Better than expected, V. Or rather, Aguilar. You'll make a strong impression on Yago, too. A trusted source tells me he's to meet soon Whoa. with a delegation of the Dogtown Voodoos. I'll forward the coordinates. I care not at all for how you handle the Gangoons. <laughs> As you will. I have only one request. Yago withdraws his candidacy. Once you've shown him reason, call me. And remember, my district's future is riding on this. Don't worry. Won't disappoint. That is the hope. Good luck. Time to go Cuban. Au côté isolé. Yago ça, c'est un petit chat. Cuidon. Allez, ça c'est pas territoire. I have good news. We will talk. I will not shed your blood. A very good deal. Moi fout avec you. Is it Yago you await? He's not coming. Havana has removed him from the picture. Catella? Is it la? Here, yes. But I have no quarrel with you. What happens next is your choice. Jacob Feb. He pral rencontre sa le mérité yon. Assez. Pas poli. En allez. Gotta wait for the man. Out in the open. Ah, wanna face off, do ya? Aguilar, you saucy senorita. There they are. Gonk's got no clue what's coming. Think I'm gonna shed a tear. Something ain't right, boss. And you are... I answer with my own question. Do you know what happens when someone in Havana lights a cigar? Somewhere in the world... Aguilar takes a life. So they say. Do you know what else they say? That you have angered the wrong people. We know of your plan to oust Bennett. We know of your new allies. The Voodoo Boys? Poor choice. 
My superiors follow Christ, Yago. I... I never intended any disrespect. What happens now? I spoke with the Voodoos. They understood their lives are worth more. Now I speak with you and wonder about the value of yours. Aguilar, please. It's not what you think. May I explain, at least? Very well. But be quick. Bennett is an Arasaka pawn. They courted him until he cracked. Then they waited. They needed the Colonel to die. I don't know what they promised him, but I do know what they want. Control of Dogtown. You have proof of Bennett's deception, I trust. Know where to find it? He goes to the city center often, Republic Way. The building's a front, occupied by a dummy corp owned by Arasaka. As to Bennett's biz there, ask him, press him. You'll see him, right? Please pass my gratitude along to your superiors. Let's go. Plot thickens. Once they're gone, uncloak for your face melts like scum Chaco. Just getting started, Johnny. Guess you ought to keep hands in the loop. Or... We could see what his favorite son's cooking up with fucking Arasaka. After all, Dogtown's future hangs in the balance. Well played, Aguilar. High five, mi hermana Cabana. High time Aguilar had a word with Bennett. Ain't our guy that. Probably his hustle. Take him out now, just in case. Save yourself the headache later. I have a bad feeling. <coughs> Tell you what Aguilar do. Dump the body, stat. Then wait for Bennett in the ride. Get the jump on him. Unmarked tactical units in Dogtown. Gordon, let's roll. But what a grind. Japanese suits have their neckties tied so fucking tight. Wait, who? Oh, fuck. Aguilar. So you know now how the Japanese tie their neckties. Do you know the Colombian way? The Colombians cut open your neck, pull your tongue out through the hole. It sounds complicated, but I've had plenty of practice. Aguilar, please, listen to me. I know what this must look like. This fuckhead Yago! Your accountant. Hmm. He's trying to cut me out. Arasaka's promised to have my back. 
All they want in exchange is access to our smuggling routes. No. What they seek is control of your smuggling routes. Only a fool would think otherwise. I'm out to secure the future. For my organization. For your bosses. You will put Arasaka behind you, Bennett. Why? Because you are in a car with Havana, while Tokyo is somewhere out there. This a geography lesson? Fucking joke! Oh, Bennett. What little regard you have for your own life. You won't let it go, is that it? Well, fine. Your legend ends here! <laughs> Do you want the throne? It is mine to give, but to a soldier, not a corporate puppet. If I see even one Arasaka shadow in Docktown, I will return and find you. But without my friendly demeanor. Is that clear? Yes, Aquilar. Understood. Supreme work, Aguilar. Time for a breather, though. Also, voodoo boys are out of the equation. Splendid. Have you anything else to add? Yup. Met with Bennett, too. Man's a sock puppet. Sock his hand up his ass. Don't worry. I pulled him off, ironed him out. For good, I hope. Ah, it's not something I asked you to do. But I do appreciate it. Bennett is still superior to Yago as a candidate. What now? Time to pay tribute to the Fallen. Aguilar will attend Hansen's funeral service and ensure a smooth transfer of power. Uh-huh. Sounds like you expect trouble. Such events can trigger geysers of raw emotion. No two people grieve alike, and rarely rationally. Ceremony and wake both at the Black Sapphire. Aguilar should enter without a hitch. Got it. Leroy et more. Vive le roi. Good luck, V. Final act. Hansen's wake. Enter Aguilar. Shit, V. Got me on the edge of my seat. Get this show on the road. Welcome to the Black Sapphire. Hope you, uh, had a pleasant flight. Thank you for coming.
to go. Don't ask why. So, you ready? Human cartel here. Get interesting. Aguilar, in honor for all of us. This is how you bid your leader farewell? Under the circumstance? I expected more. Pomp. Pomp? Well, <laughs> we did what we could. What felt right. Take me to Bennett. He came with extra security. Got a bad feeling. Aguilar, what a surprise. I understand you've met. Havana sends its condolences. The news of Colonel Hansen's death shook us all. I'm sure the Colonel would appreciate your goodwill. You're dismissed. I met earlier with the Lieutenant Colonel. We had a lovely conversation, talking of this and that. In the end, we both agreed Dogtown needs a strong leader. That leader will be Bennett. The people here heed his words. As will you, Yago. Oh, until when? Until you leave town and he's free to stab me in the back? I want names, contacts, connections. Your informants in the NCPD, everyone on your payroll. Ridiculous. You will prove your loyalty to me. It's a fair price. You will pay it. Hansen would say, only the weak make concessions. Keep the Colonel's name out of your mouth. You snip at each other like two crazy chihuahuas. Is this what your Colonel would want? Were he still alive, his choice would be swift. Yago to keep his place in rank, the right hand to Lieutenant Colonel Bennett as leader. Am I wrong? Alongside your colonel, in this very coffin, you will bury the hatchet. This is Dogtown's only path forward. Hmm. That could work. We have a deal. Hope I won't regret it. At last, 
You have a tendency to complicate the simplest things in Night City. Dog-eat-dog world, I guess. What's that make dog town? A warning to you, Silverhand. One you will heed. are going seeing dark spots it's hard to breathe want to help tell me how what the hell took so long so yeah talk to reed huh and Stubborn old bastard, Reed. Poke long enough, you could drill a hole. Anything new? Anything at all? A bit of lecturing, a few FIA-backed threats thrown in. You know the drill. Ah, negotiating by the book. That's what everybody at the firm called it. 
think Reed cares about you, truly. Has a use for me, maybe. But one use only. To feel good about himself. What he's doing. So young, yet so jaded. You're so tiny, said the Picobot to the Nanomech. <sighs> Let's roll. Seems you've got a plan after all. To help us both. I do. And it relies heavily, if not wholly, on you. Black Clinic, remember? It's on Luna. Got a flight all lined up to get me there. Uh, wanna go with you? No, V. Impossible. One and only one. It's all they're expecting. And it's just not open to negotiation. In all likelihood, I'll serve as their lab rat once there. AI's within the neural matrix. They're going to extract it. Create a prototype cure for us. I'll contact you. As soon as they're ready for us both. I promise. Well, be a waiting word. So, spaceflight means spaceport. NCX. It's where we're heading. Now, I can't just stride in. I draw attention from who knows who in my condition. So you'll stride in. Then head to the Tycho Terminal. Find a side door to open for me. What about spaceport security? Tycho Terminal's being renovated. So not many bodies. Lots of cover. Also minimal security, probably. Can't ignore that factor. Think you'll have the strength to net run? Full on net running. Maybe via your personal. All this shit's too much. Damn, V. I've wronged so many. Hurt so many. Can't help wondering if it's even avoidable. You know? Hurting others? Someone revealed their secrets, revealed themselves to me. It's a burden, a duty. When a jewel's entrusted to you, you focus. Don't lose it, find the strength not to disappoint. <laughs> Booster feet! I... <sighs> Relax. Read okay. that. I don't want to die. Can't help but regret. I just... Help me... Ditch this town. Meds are kicking in. You're all right. We shouldn't linger. Grab the wheel. Could you? Let me scan you. Need to know how you're doing. State you're in. Whatever you want. Hmm. Shit. This isn't right. Degen's fast. Too fast for any known pathogen. Metastasis spreading straight from the brain. Said Tycho Terminal's closed for refurbishment. Sure you can fly out of there in spite? Got a one-way ticket. From someone who follows their own rules. You've had shit luck with partners lately. Till you came along. Working out kinda okay. Try and rest up.
just jail yourself. We'll be pulling in. Thinking back to that first contact you made, we've come a long way. I haven't quite reached this end yet. Obviously, you can't be packing when you go in. Standard spaceport security. Leave your iron with me. I'll have it when we meet up again. Maybe I mask up. I mean, Reed does know my face. If I tag you by the tech sig as you went through security, it's their gear. They'd finger it anywhere. So what's your super spy secret for being invisible? Moving on the sly. Just act normal, like any other passenger. Don't stop and talk, make eye contact, linger or look aimless. You have a terminal and gate to get to. Oh, fuck. Flashback coming in hard. Got Becky Plaza iced. Banish that shit. You're better than you were. Armed or not, you'll manage. So again, Tycho Terminal. Get there unnoticed by anyone who matters. Eyes peeled for orbital air guards, especially. We can't know what they'll be watching for. Join up soon. Hey, V. Orbital Air welcomes you to LCX, Night City International and Translunar. You certainly can't fly. Orbital Air certainly can. Okay, on the port tonight. In Pasteria clear of bogus. Ganic and Cyber. Orbital Air welcomes you to NCX. Night City International and Translunar. You certainly can't fly. Orbital Air certainly can. Like that. It's like there's a flyby. Three, two, one, and live. Jillian Jordan of N54 You need to stay calm, sir. I firmly City protest. You've no right to power down my implants. implants. Scans all the Mr. Stud does not qualify as a weapon. Operation. Welcome to Night City International and Translunar, your gateway to the world and the stars. I need to temporarily power down any unauthorized implants, personal leaks, and the panel case. Over along too, let me give you the compact version. We are not unauthorized implants. Specifically, a detailed schedule was in the spaceport terms and condition. You acknowledged when you purchased your ticket. Hey. Rain. Of course. Be chill. Draw no attention. Implant power down. Complete. For biometric ID authentication, please look at the camera. Wait! Don't yet! Buy me some time. Need to link your metrics to a fake profile. Um, uh, which cam would that be? That one. I'm not sure what you want me to do. Look at the camera, please. It'll be over in a few seconds. All set. Go ahead. Do it. Scans all good. Over to there. Thanks you for your cooperation and your patience. Okay. Now you need to let me in. Tycho Terminal. Go. Apologies? No I couldn't give a shit. Apology to our viewers. Opening ceremony, like coverage. That's what they expect. Games start in a few hours. That's ours. In the event of flight delays of 12 hours or more, 
Passengers are entitled to a refund of their ticket price. Ticket price? Are you shitting me? Try millions in damages when we sue. Wanna calm down, please? A little civility, maybe? Regard for the other passengers. I'll calm down when I fucking land in Sydney. I'm already not getting anywhere here. Mr. Wawuda should expect a call from Mr. Mucker. V? Is that you? Cynthia, Pepe's wife? Yeah, of course. How's Pepe? And right, how's the kid doing? They're fine. Everything's fine. Drop by later when the crowd's gone. We'll talk. Listen, Tycho Terminal. Need to slink in. Any idea how I could? You can't. Renovation's been a shit show. Literally. You know they accidentally broke through to the restrooms in the main lobby? Oh, sorry. I really need to get back to work. Look at these sheep. Ba, ba. What about? Firefight could break out any second. They're none the wiser. Think. You're standing there, imagining the preen boobs they're gonna glue on you out in orbit. Next thing you know, the panic herds tremble. Same thought you had at Arasaka Tower as you pulled the pin on the bomb. Careful. I can stay, too. Got some work to finish. Come on. Passengers are kindly asked not to expose themselves. Ah, the you premises. look spent. This? My 14th flight in five days. Yeah, I know. Artificial gravity. The rotation. Makes me want to puke, too. Another war is in the air, I'm telling you. Perales will take a stab at annexing Dogtown, and US won't stand for it. All the better. What is good this? Prophets will rain down. Duck lock, that's four. Shut down triggering when the alarm goes off, right? It should be. Hand me the torps. Motherfucker. I got FIA agents on the Owen. They breached. Detection by orbital security means a brawl, I say. No chance of detection. Our people are the best. Invisible to me, too. I didn't know what to look for. Our people, huh? Just hurry the hell up. Away fucking needs better tech. That and better techies. We use spots like this in a crowd. Peeps panic. Carnage virtually guaranteed.
Hey, hey, hold on. We know each other, remember? Agony. I'm a regular. Okay, not a regular. Huh. Must know you from some club, I'm sure of it. Nah, I don't seem right. Oh, yeah. Think I know. Kentucky Plaza, Lobby Bar. Don't know you, man. Hey, easy, okay. Just ask. And here's security. Ha ha ha. Stop fucking around. Flight. It's always like this. Why don't you change the schedule? I pay for first class and then have to mix with this riffraff. Ah, you look spent. This? My 14th flight in five days. Yeah, I know. Artificial gravity. Terminals closed for renovations. Hey, stop! You're not allowed back here! B, hey, damn it! I don't like that. Another war is in the air, I'm telling you. Paralysis will take a stab at annexing Dogtown, and you also ah! have hmm. Hold up better. What is your bits? Hey! Get up! <clears throat> Words you're looking for are... Fuck me, I think. Detainees awake. Either charge me, I'll official, or let me go. Gotta do one or the other. We don't gotta do anything, friend. Get yourself together, V. Got good news and shit news. Ladder first. They've locked you up. Upside. Lockup's actually inside the Tycho Terminal. What the hell were you thinking? If getting into the Tycho Terminal were that simple, I'd be sitting on that shuttle hours ago. Ain't the end of life on Earth, Song. Got myself nabbed. Not about to stay in lockup. Right. Good. We'll get this done done. Gonna see what I can do to free you. Tell you what. Get me access to the system. Find a port, jack in, I'll see what's possible. Just don't let the guard see you. See me all right? Clear and sharp. Give me a sec now. I've come to get you. Thanks. Now wait. I am please. Open it is. Now come out. Eyes killed for the guard. Gotcha.
What? Where now? Now we get creative. Need deeds. I managed to reach the roof. Lower bit, though. Need your help to climb higher and join you. Shape you're in. Can't possibly hope to walk a high wire. It's 120... 30 feet. Oh. Better look around. ways a bit. I'm sorry. Stop it. It'll be over soon. Thanks in no small part to you. Your weapons. No gun, no fun. Shh, hold up. What is it? Catching a radio signal. Encrypted channel. Can you breach? Listen in. Giving it a shot. Need to move on quietly, V. Another fuck up and we're done for. Hey, did what I could. Have to try harder. Sly and smooth. This way. Oh shit. Sigs. An NUS comms frequency. Myers. Incoming. Four to five sex. No more. In here. Quick. Fuck me. FIA will find us. Reed said so. Hasn't yet. Let's keep it that way. Fuck. She's on board. They're gonna land. Get it open. Somi, get inside! Got control of the van. One of the blades. I'll squeeze through. Combat choppers buzz in the free city of NC. 
Shit's heating up. NCX is not technically part of NC. Ex-territorial. Neutral zone. This is Myers basically blowing off international law and agreements. Got a light ahead. Security, hold up a sec. Okay, moved on. Alert now, eyes and ears. Waiting somewhere. Concealed. Most likely. Just doesn't cut it. Does Orbital Air know the stakes? They triggered the alarm but failed to find V. And our agents? Cover's been blown on a handful. OA won't get a word out of them. I guarantee it. Those still undercover are looking for Songbird. We'll talk about operational errors later. Asking for help. Never was your strong suit. So I decided for you, and brought support. I have everything under control. No, Saul. You lost control way back. It's time you acknowledge that. Oh, Rosalind Myers. Her true face. Fuck the one on our billboards. care about the girl. Like her. You recruited her, trained her. I get that you want to protect her, but your duty, first and foremost, is to your country. Songbird made her choice. Now she needs to learn what the consequences are. There's one more thing, Saul. The project she was part of. Stays well under wraps. None of it leaks. This is bad. Really bad. If our little bird lands in the wrong hands, I don't want to think what will happen. All that. We're the only ones privy. It would destroy the NUS. It's not a risk I'm willing to take. We're on the same page. No risks. That's how it'll be. Do you hear that? Just so you know, this isn't any easier for me, Reed. I liked the girl, trusted her. But with some choices, there's no way back. Choices? Yours or hers? Say again? You heard me. But no matter. I know what I have to do, and I'll do it. If I authorize you to take any and all necessary action, just try not to shoot her in the head. I'd have expected as much. You heard it. Yes, sir. We are fucked. Every which way possible. Myers is some bitch. She's just getting started. Let's go, Evacuated. Uh huh. Prepping to blow in here with all they got. Okay. Back to the terminal now. Need to delta through loop fast before all hell breaks loose. Train right to the launch pad. That's all. Just need to blast through the Tycho terminal first. Myers assault team. 
Shit show starting. Any U.S. soldiers will be up there. The fuckers bleed each other out. Thought they spotted us. V, if that chopper gets a lock on us, we'll be as good as dead. Do our damnedest to avoid it then. No peeps. Take point. All clear. Oh, the spinning hang for a sec.
Could take a look at your chrome. Is that even safe? Most of your sub assemblies. I'm familiar. Could run auto diagnostics, grant you access to your bios. Got a readout. I can overclock the compensators. Hope they can take it. It was gonna be different, all this. Smoother. But the goal's what counts, right? Not far off. So, unscheduled flight to Luna. How much these days? A convo including a few secrets. Hmm. Of the state variety? State variety, personal variety. In my case, unified. Blackwell. That the issue? Hmm. And other things. Rather not talk about it. Just... Don't judge me, okay? Ever tell you I think troubles just gravitate your way? Like stink to a monkey, I swear. Hidden talent, I say. Let's get our shit together. Come on. Help me out, can you? Looking a little better. You mean that? I'll bring a train in. Take point. You never know. Watch out! Shit! Trap! Not falling. Think so? Get out of sight. Train in. Straight to the launch pad.
All clear! Did you get hit? I'm okay. Okay. Flight control tower. Heading there. Got a train to bring you to the station. What now? I'll fire up the control panel. Bring the train in. What do you want me to do? Watch my comfort zone. Keep it clear of Meyer's minions. Sure. Let's do this. Good luck, Sung. Let me help. Lean on me. Got a train to catch. Fuck, that hurts. It's got I know so me, but you killed it. Saved our asses. Me. You hear that? It's the black hole. No fears. Right here with you.
head soon. Finally. <sighs> Still with me? Holding up? <sighs> what do you think? Final stretch? Worst behind us. As I see it, the worst is always what was, not what'll be. <laughs> An optimist analyst. How the hell did you ever hold down your job? Proper work-life balance. And separation. Listen to the hum. Wish I could fall asleep. Never to wake again. So me? Reed. Had a dream about him recently. I repeat. Same damn nightmare. About that same damn train. Him dying because of what I did. Could be Reed's having the same nightmares. Heard it all already from him. Hmm. <laughs> he put his trust in you for a time. Trust me, then boldly betrayed. Well, Johnny'd be blunt, if not downright crude. I'll just say, betraying a friend, nothing worse. I regret it. I do, but can't turn back time. I'd like to just forget. Actually, think Reed forgave you. Song. Reed's not the only one I've betrayed. What do you mean, Song? Neural Matrix V. Can only be used once. Once? How so? It's a captive AI from beyond the wall. Relies on continuous evolution to exist. I'll free it, and end the process. It'll then execute my commands and disintegrate irretrievably. How long have you known this? That only one of us could come out alive? Sign of sure. I learned it existed. Started delving into Serious? I... I think... I think... I'm gonna die soon. The regret... I wasn't honest with you. I'm sorry. You could have told me the truth. Would have helped you anyway. I did fuck. Color me impressed. Bird took everyone for a ride. Myers, Hanson, Reed, you. Having some fun with me, are you? No, I'm fucking serious. Takes character to be a bastard front to back and inside out. Believe me, I know. Woman's obsessed, determined to a fault. That earns my respect. Fuck all that. Thing is, you and me are back at square one. We still have that problem. 
finding some way to save ourselves. Could always call Reed on the hollow. <laughs> Think he'd kill me. Damn, globe-sized ego, V. You mean zilts to him. One, just one person he's gunning for. Well, nice to drop in and shoot some shit, V. High time you woke up. Almost there. Clearly, need some help. The only there. It's in sight. You're down. Go now. So, what do you want to do? Reed, she's fucking dying. I see two near corpses with a death wish. Your fault alone if she kicks it. Right, because you and Myers had no hand in this shit. That is all that awaits her on the moon. You want to save her? Leave her to me. Back on the roof, Myers ordered the kill. You didn't protest. You heard it. Every last word. The situation has changed. Just leave Songbird to me. I can still help her. That biz seven years ago? Song followed Myers' order, then never forgave herself for it. It'll be the same for you. Remorse to the end of your days. But this ain't about song anymore, V. No, this is about her not sparking another war. And taking Songbird to Washington, she'll answer for treason. She has to. You're right. Song's curb stomped everyone to get what she wants. Condemned me to death. Let me guess. She promised. Then she didn't deliver. Just one dose. One instance of the cure exists. So, decided to keep it. But left me with nothing. I see. Songbird for me, one dose for you. Need the cure and the rippers who know how to use it. Mention contacts in Europe, personal ones. In Europe, at Langley, too. The NUSA specialist at the top of the game. They'll pull the data for you, then operate. Do we have a deal? How am I to know your people will recover the neural matrix? Any guarantee? I can't pretend to know this shit inside out. Remember though, Sinus Shore's out there. Say I survive. What happens to Song, dare I ask? We'll do our damnedest to stop the Black Wall degeneration. Look for other ways. Myers wants Song dead. Condemned her already. Myers couldn't let her escape. If we get her, alive, have her in our hands, the NUSA will be safe. Songbird will live. Not giving her up, Saul. No. No! But your 
friend there will join Reed in the beyond if you don't hurry your ass. Get him, be okay. One last push. From here on out, you're on your own. You might make it, might not. That just ain't my biz anymore. Got my own shit to tend to. High time I did that. Life support activated. Onboard computers. Oh. Warning system memory clear. Space is pure freedom, so me. Turning back now. T minus 60 seconds. RS 25, main engine ignition. Here we go. First time I've ever launched a spacecraft. You? Same, man. Same. T minus 50 seconds. Solid propellant engines burning. Spark igniters active. She won't get far. You doubt she's gonna make it? No idea. Wherever she goes, her problems will follow. She's free. Slammed at home. She has just a bit of what I lacked entirely. Fucking luck. Luck played no part in it, Johnny. You and her just wanted different things. Really? So do tell, what was it I wanted so badly? Applause, cheers. Did absolutely everything to please the crowd. Nah, maybe. Guess I could have done more, been different. Maybe. Could also be I was convinced I couldn't make it out alive. And maybe. Just maybe that chick had great follow-through to the fucking end. And I lacked that last ounce of determination. Duh. Well, at least you're being honest with yourself. That in itself's some version of freedom. What do you say next? Be all you could be? Limitations are all in my head. Just watch the show, Johnny. T Zero, lift. Found out Treasures are always lost Pleasures and rage come back I'm watching you Be careful with your moves Tonight 
found out treasures are always lost pleasures and rage come back I'm watching you be careful with your moves
I found out treasures are always lost. Pleasures are long forgotten. Who are you? When I fall, I fall 
a distance Never knowing which way's up, down It's never what it seems When it's all I'm ever missing And it feels as though I'm waiting And I don't need no head in my hands To know I'm ever heading way south I think I'll find it all somewhere between the ice and fire Cause it's all I'm ever thinking And I need another savior I don't hear anything about it right now Take down all of this is jaded somehow Take down All of this is traded somehow
found out Treasures are always lost Pleasures and rage come back I'm watching you Be careful with your mood
find out Treasures are always lost Pleasures are long forgotten Who are you? Where do we go from here? Now, we wave bye-bye to your dreams of living a long, happy life. We'll see how the dice roll. And things ain't all bad, at any rate. Politicos and spies at war, us in the middle. We came out whole. Sure as shit made some enemies, powerful ones, too. Myers will remember. Won't let it pass. No fucking way after you killed the most loyal of her hounds. If another war breaks out, Reed'll just be the first to have fallen of so, so many. Guy fought his own war for his rare ideals. Tombs like that, nobody remembers them. Nobody. Need to shift focus now. To myself. My own path. I'll say. Fucking with NUSA plans launching a half-dead cyborg into orbit. Adds bricks to that edifice called Legend. But clock's ticking, friend. You're dying. Gotta do something about it. 